this is just a must. Put me in perspective, put the deepest in the cut. Everybody tuning in, but this is just for us now. We know I ain't ballin' yet. Hoes wanna holler, oh no, I don't call them back. Girl, let me see you hold it down, we gon' have a blast. Cause I just wanna know what you gonna do with all of that. Ain't gotta say a word. I know what's up, you can have it all. Watch me rip it off. I'll admit it, you got me feeling hella love. Even when it's going down, know that we gon' live it up. Young shot caller, always been a baller. Know that you the one, I can feel it in my heart. Yeah, I won't stop charging. We going come harder. I can see you and I way beyond the stars, girl. I can never ever find the right words. And there's no way this is real life. There's no telling you're the right girl. So I can only say it feels right. Hello, my Hoyas. We're gonna start in a bit. Just gonna post a tweet. And then maybe get some more uh, sub drinks. What's up, Brian Campo? What's up, Koya? Norms. God, it's real. <clears throat> Iba na yung setup natin yun. Um, sort of. Hmm, hindi ko alam kung gusto ko mag ano. Nakakatuyo ng bibi, nakakatuyo ng bibig yung yung ano. Root beer. Tsaka dumidikit talaga sa ano, sa ngipin mo yung root beer. What's up John R? <clears throat> Siyempre meron tayong uh, YouTube ng Xiaomi para ano, para ma talaga tayo agad. Yun talaga. That's how we roll. So we still got some time uh, before the the show starts. Kawai kawai sa mga nakakuha ng 99 sales sa Lazada jan. Anong uh, nabili nyo sa Lazada? I didn't. Nakita na balita ako yung 99 sales pero tinatapod na ako magcheck eh. Ano daw na ako ng BTS sa LTE dito? Well, hopefully, ma, hopefully, kaya, I mean, hopefully you have enough LTE, kaya norm, super bilis. Edi, wow, magaling. That's good. That's good. <coughs> That's good. Magape, what time is it on you? Isn't? I think lo, huli yung tul, yung oh nga, 9:55 na dito, 9:52 sa PC ko. Oh, but not data yung aking work. My phone is on data, what the hell? Dumb stupid phone. <coughs> Kuya Alex, ano sa sabi mo sa cloud phone na sila ang pinaka unang 89 na may quad camera sa buong mundo. Wait. Na release na ba 'yon? Napaka joke kasi ng joke time kasi si cloud phone eh. Walang ano, kinain ng sistema 'yon eh. Kinain ng vloggers. Um, just so you know, meron kasing ganito Ang story yan yun, yung mga nangangain na vloggers uh, Merong groups of vloggers Or a, let's say just one group of vloggers Na um, Basically, inaangkin nila yung isang brand Sabihin nila, exclusive sa uh, Group of vloggers na to Ang coverage ng isang brand Lahat ng review, lahat ng event nila Ng program, ng ng launch event nila and then sasabihin nila kompleto na yun hindi nyo na kailangan na ibang vloggers bawal ibang vloggers dyan so <laughs> nakakatawa dun nauuto yung brands kasi <sighs> the brands don't know any better and parang siguro they don't have budget to actually do hire people that actually know the shit to, what to do the shit to do with uh, their brand and shit So, papayag sila, akala nila, okay, we got we got this amount of vloggers, okay na tayo. Pero actually, ang ina, sorry sorry sa pagmura, pero wala silang, ano, wala silang influensya. Siguro pag sinagsama-sama ko, kahit, kahit dalawang po na vloggers na yon yung nasa group na yon actually, hindi naman sila dalawang po doon. Siguro, wala pa sa kalingkingan, I mean, hindi naman sa nagyayabang ako, maliit lang akong vlogger, pero wala pa sa... Maliit na nga ako, wala pa sa kalingkingan ng YouTube subscribers ko yung subscribers nila. As in, wala pa sa 1,000 or 2,000 siguro. Total ha, lahat pinagsama-sama ha. Okay, hindi naman, sabihin natin hindi YouTube. 
yung views nila sa mga website nila hindi rin ganun kataas okay ang problema yung katulad ng mga phones mga brands na katulad ng uh, uh, ano pa nga Kata tsaka Cloudphone nauuto sa ganun so wala kaming coverage ng Kata tsaka Cloudphone kinain sila ng sistema kinain ng blood na tayo magagawa <laughs> anong, anong kukoverin ko dun wala naman ako yun wala naman ako invite ah <clears throat> Napuyat ako sa 99 sale ng Lazada, patapuan lang yung 99 sale. Usually naman, kasi hindi naman sila magbebenta ng sobrang, sobrang matinding produkto dyan. Hinahin sila ng Chistema. 99 sale and MSI auction. Okay, habang, uh, anong oras na ba? Oh, 2 minutes. 2 uh, minutes lang, kukuha tayo ng, kukuha ko ng, no, pa ako eh, kukuha ko ng, gusto nyo makita yung, ito yung bago nating setup, although, me yeah, medyo ano eh yeah. <laughs> Hello wow luma pa yung chat box ko Um nandito na tayo <laughs> may jacket pa ako sa likod May opo jacket tayo diyan <laughs> na hindi kasi sa akin Um So an yung computer natin dati ayun nandun sa likod Right So dati doon ako nag nakaupo doon And then doon ako nagse-stream ng sa BTS Right? So, itong setup na to, dito tayo nag unbox recently. And, eh, inano ko na siya, ginugroom ko talaga siya for new live streaming platform. And, uh, dito ko na talaga balak mag-stream. Yun nga lang, meron tayong background. May background tayo ngayon. So, uh, pansamantala, hindi ko alam kung ano gagawin ko eh. Uh, actually, dapat nandito sa kaliwa yung ano. May monitor ako dito. Dito ko sana ilalagay yung webcam. Katulad nung, nung gaming streams natin nung isang araw. Doon ko ilalagay yung webcam. Kaya lang nilagay ko ngayon dito. Wala lang. Pansamantala. <laughs> Tignan lang natin. <clears throat> Mass production na tumawala na ang place ng mga local ngayon kuya. Hindi yun eh. Sana mining rig mo ha. Hey what's up? Uh, kuya Gigant and then uh, Luby Game. Ah yung mining rig ko nandun sa kabila. Let's uh, you wanna you wanna see the mining, you know? I don't think I've shown this before. Let's go full screen. Can we do full screen? Kaya lang yung webcam ko is gonna be. <laughs> green. Wait lang. Let's try a green screen. <laughs> it's an Oppo jacket. There's a green screen right there. There's my op there's my green screen. Yay! All right. What's up Koya Antonio Arenas? Um Yeah, let's uh hindi ko alam kung pwede. I'll I'll know. Wait lang ah. Eh. Let's go starting soon. Maglalagay na ako sa aking webcam software. Ay, syempre nakikita niyo yung webcam software ko, di ba? Wait lang. Uh, asan ba yun? Uh, YouTube live stream only. Let's just turn on, uh, turn off the display muna. Monitor capture. There we go. Para makalagin ako sa aking ano. <clears throat> so makita yung, uh, so makita yung mga mining rig. Hindi naman. Well, ito, start monitoring. There we go. <laughs> uh, Napas siya lang. What's up, Kuya RJ Villamer? There we go. Yan. <laughs> nandyan yung mining rig. Obviously, hindi nyo masyado makikita. Pero nandyan yan. <clears throat> Oon natin yung audio. Para marinig nyo yung fans. Oh, gusto nyo mag-zoom. Ano yan eh? Oh, gusto nyo mag- uh, Ano? Yan no? Wow, such webcam. Ang ginagawa ng bisikleta. Yeah, tipis. Ng bisikleta ko tsaka yung exercise bike. <laughs> tsaka ano ano na dito. Kahon na ang kahon nito na ng extension cord. Oh my god, nagwawala ang aking ano. Yun eh. Tapos yun yung mining rig. Sandali. Kaya ba natin mag-zoom in? Paano ba mag-zoom in dito? Uh, this one? No, no, no. That's not it. 
I don't know how to zoom in, mako ya. Noob ako noob. Plus, no, hindi yun eh. Oh well. That's the mining mining rig right there with the light. Yung makita mo yung ilaw na to. Sa gitna. Wala, hindi nyo nakikita yung mouse ko. Naka-off yung mouse capture ko eh. <clears throat> What's up sa overpriced ng V7 ng V4? Nako <laughs> <clears throat> kak mining. Uh, <clears throat> wag mo na i Wag mo na ipihit yang camera mo baka mamaya may mumud. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> Pero ang ganda nung Astrid na CCTV na yun, wireless yun ah, ano yun, wifi yun ah. Tapos, uh, may wireless control ba siya kung gusto mong controlin. Astrid, paranormal ni Bench PC. Oh, hindi ah, nandito yung Bench PC oh, right there oh. Ando na siya. Nandito na yung Bench PC right there. Kung nasan yung PC ngayon na ginagamit ko, pinagpalit ko with the Bench PC right there. So actually, ito ah. Hindi ako kayo ng uh, walang kwentang walang kwentang tour. Alright. Uh, hopefully, hindi lang ma maka mahatak yung kable na mat matanggal sa ano. So, ay nako. Ay nako. Ano nangyari sa display ko? Wait. Oh, wow. Nag nag wow. So, uh, ito yung aking uh, full-fledged uh, high-end well, high PC na lang ang tawagin natin. No? Uh, dati yan, nandito. Doon. So, tanggalin natin yung chat box kasi hindi naman wala naman ko yung chat box na yan. Saan yung chat? Ba't ayaw mawala? Yun. Okay. So, dati nandun yung PC na yan. Right? <laughs> ngayon, my, yan, yun, yan yung bench PC ngayon. Yan yung ginagamit ko dun sa isang, TV, isang monitor na lang siya ngayon. Yan. So, kung gusto ko manood ng YouTube, gusto ko manood ng Netflix bago matulog, dyan na ako nanonood ngayon. So, hindi ko kailangan ng high-end PC dyan eh. So, ang itong PC na to, bench PC yan. Kaya lang in-upgrade ko uh, i3-7100 na yan. But pretty much the same, exactly the same PC with the... And, and ba bali, wala lang yung upgrade na yun. It's just that I have an i3-7100 lying around. So, in-upgrade ko siya. Binalik ko yung G4560 dun sa mining rig. Kung nasa, yung kung saan yung nakita yung CCTV kanina. Ito ngayon, yung uh, 6700 with uh, 1080Ti na ano, yun yung palit na yun. That one. Uh, and then dito na tayo magsi-stream for now. <laughs> dito na tayo magsi-stream ngayon. Mga kuya. Hindi ko lang alam kung paano natin ayusin yung ating uh, background situation. Kasi ang pangit ng background natin. Uh, gawin lang natin kumot yung ano, yung Oppo jacket. Baliktad pa no. Gawin natin kumot yung Oppo jacket. Mm -hmm. Siyempre, naka-red tsaka green ako para, ano, para Christmas. Christmas in our hearts na ngayon, mga kuya. Naka-organize mo. Napa, ano? Hindi ako organize, kuya. Bulok lang talaga. Akala mo lang yun. <laughs> Akala mo lang yun. Napipake, napipake ka ng gamit natin dito. Fake lang yan. Fake news yan. Ayan. Opo. Asan yung brand ng Opo? Hindi to yun eh. Meron tayong Oppo ano, may Oppo may Oppo A71 tayo, pwede nating unbox sa yun. Yan, Oppo brand. Ay, saan napunta? Yan. <laughs> Gawin na lang natin, ganyan na lang natin siya. Ah. Uh, Astig CCTV. Ano na ba? Ano, magsimula na ba tayo? Let's see, let's see the stream. All right, it's doing okay. So ngayon, um Ah, gusto niyo makita yung, yung setup natin ngayon? Let's go! Sana hindi ma, ma, mahatak yung ating kable masyado. So, ayun yung, ayun yung PC natin ngayon na nagsistream. Right? Keyboard, mouse. Ito yung 4K TV natin. Ngayon nakaset to 1080p kasi para hindi tayo, ano, um, para hindi mahirap mag-capture ng web browser. Kasi kung naka 4K yan, masyadong-masyadong maliit yung, ano, yung font. Masyadong, hindi nyo mababasa yung fonts ng, ng mga web browser. 
So, 1080 ngayon yan. And then, meron tayong 1080 dito na monitor. Tapos yan. Yan, sabi mo, organize ako. Eh. Basura, oh. Basura, basura. So, um, tapos, may basura pa siguro. Mahanap pa tayong basura. Ayan, bas Hindi basura yan. May mga ano dyan. Actually, ito yung isa nating... Whew! Such, such shaky cam. Oh, meron tayong pwedeng i-unbox dito. A71 ni Oppo. Tsaka, actually, pwede natin i-unbox yung isa, isa pang gamit dito. Tignan mo yung damit. Oh. <laughs> meron tayong router from Asus. Oh, ha? <coughs> okay, kumuna na ngayon. So, itang kita nyo, magaling ako magtago ng mga basura dito. Sa Hindi man basura, pero gulong, magulong gamit dito sa sa bahay natin, no? Sa kwarto natin. Nako-conscious na ako at uh, nakikita nyo yung aking uh, <laughs> gulo ng kwarto. Grabe. <laughs> Iso, unprofessional, mga kuya. Nakakahiya. Iso, nakakahiya, mga kuya. What does the chat say? What does the chat say? Nasaan na yung chat ko? Walang niya. Okay. What's up, Daryl Samin? Raffle mo na yan. Alin yung raffle? Hindi ko nakita yung sabi, yung raffle na sinasabi nyo. Uh, we have contacted Acer. And uh, hindi ko alam kung makakahingi tayo. Pero they are actually trying to come up with more of the... Yan ha. Marami na tayong, marami na tayong galawan sa ano ngayon, sa BTS ngayon. Kasi pwede na. Meron na tayong ano eh. Meron na tayong roly-poly ano eh. Roly-poly upuan. Wee! Tsaka, siyempre, maraming space na ako para gumalaw. Di ka tulad doon. Wala na akong... Nakaupo lang talaga ako doon, eh. Tamad kasi akong bata, eh. Ayan. So, nag-request tayo sa Acer kung pwede tayong bigyan ng isa pang... Isa pang ganito. Yung ating clock fan. Ayan. Yung paborito nyo yung clock fan. Na hindi naka... Pucha, nabali. <laughs> Naipit sa... Naipit sa bag ko. <laughs> ah, wawa naman si clock fan. Ayan, hindi ko na, hindi ko na sisindihan Basta ito yung clock fan na parang RGB uh, Hindi natin alam kung bibigyan tayo for raffle Pero tignan natin Ahem uh, Bermans na, the Tupperware show Lol, clickbait, I thought iPhone 8 launch It, <laughs> It's the clock, it's the iPhone, it's the It's a, it's a tech talk before the iPhone 8 launch I wonder, but di na upgrade ng Oppo at Vivo ang Android version nila, and like OnePlus na sister company naman nila. It's just a different, ano? It's just a different attitude towards uh, products, you know. Um, Oppo and, and Vivo are concentrating more on experiences rather than, uh, you know, they 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 have different, parang priorities. When it comes to their brands, the Oppo is now prioritized. That the Oppo is targeting high end, right? Targeting Apple, Apple level craftsmanship and design. They still are, but Oppo is now more on mid range uh, selfie phones and stuff like that. Vivo is actually going a little bit higher range with their MediaTek pro with their Snapdragon processor. See, Oppo, the mada. Si Oppo, ano eh, daming, uh, daming MediaTek ngayon eh, like the Oppo A71. We should unbox this later, maybe. I don't know. We, we can set up another tripod and stuff. Uh, I wonder, uh, Archer, ha, may space na. The BTS clock fan start na kuya. Ah, uh, yeah. So, I don't think we have time to actually, for me to actually get some uh, drinks anymore. Sad life. Totoo ba na tatlo ang bagong iPhone sa September 12th? Eight, iPhone 8, 7S, and 7S Plus? We don't know. <laughs> That's the big question for this ano, this week, this this Monday or this Tuesday. Uh, depending on where you live. Nakaka-conscious talaga yung, ano, yung, yung background sa likod. Kailangan natin ng green screen. Can I? Kailangan na. We need this. There we go. Oh, no. Yan, yan. We need this green screen. Cover up my ugly, ugly room. <clears throat> At least my Snapdragon option, man. Uh, yeah. Uh, damn. So toto lang. I think the most exciting thing today is the Xiaomi. Eh. Rainer Lizada, hi, Alex, and mga kabites late na pumaho. Now we're just starting. 
we're still in the coca kwentuhan mode kind of uh what's going on on facebook real quick okay like our phone well I, what okay so i have a question now with what the hell go is going on with with fucking facebook right why is there no button to say you've already read this notification now but get on huh Di ba may button dati, you, you click on the... Uh, oh, hindi pa tapos yan, no? si B2G. Hindi, hindi tapos na pala. Uh, why can't... Ayun, Mark Andre. Jesus ko naman. Ba't wala yun kanina? Happy birthday. Yes, happy birthday po kay uh, Sir Ryan Uy of uh, Star Mobile. Isa sa mga... Batikan. Batikan. <laughs> Ang sarap gamitin ng word na batikan eh. Batikang tao sa industriya ng smartphones natin dito sa Pilipinas. Ngayon ay nasa, ano, ah, nasa ah, ngayon, well, nasa Star Mobile. Di naman darating officially sa Pinas ang Xiaomi A1, di ba? Mukha ng Google Plus ang Facebook. <laughs> okay, so, yun ang magandang tanong. Kasi, well, okay, so, one thing I learned, oh, may dumi sa aking TV. One thing I learned sa, sa May, Meizu event uh, kahapon, I think that was yesterday, Ninja Buttons. <laughs> Sorry, hindi. Nawala eh, kanina. Nawala. I don't know what happened. but uh, So, one thing I learned with uh, yesterday's Meizu event uh, is that I met up with a guy, uh, Vice President ng Hellotronics, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, it should be around. Andito dapat yung ano niya. Kanyang... Uh, Business card. Let's see. Uh, we met up with Jimmy He of uh, Xiaomi, uh, Overseas Sales Department. Uh, Trisha Lee, uh, Overseas Sales Department, then, ng uh, Meizu. They have very nice uh, business cards. The cool. Wow. Nagiging. Oh, look at that. Oh, no. Ang <laughs> ng effect pag. Akala nung. <laughs> it's big. <laughs> Ang cool sana kaya lang. It's just a. Uh, it's an effect of the green screen. Okay, uh, and then we met up I with I Sir Ian Braza of, uh, uh, I I'm pretty sure this is, uh, part of the, what do you call this? Hellotronics, Hellotronics, right? So, sila Hello Hellotronics yung nagdadala ng, uh, Xiaomi, uh, and Meizu. Well, actually, Meizu is a, is a physical, has come physical stores and, and stuff. Dito sa Pilipinas ngayon, right? So, si Electronics lang yung nagdala ng, ng digital version ng, uh, ng, ng Meizu product. So, they're selling, let's actually, we can, we can actually go to Lazada right now. One thing I learned is that Zenfone 4 is still freaking overpriced. <laughs> yeah, um, it's still pretty pricey, dude. So, sila yung nagdala ng ano dito. So, if we're looking at any of these Meizu, sila, sila yung nagdadala ng Hellotronics. And there were people, a lot of people asking me about uh, products from Hellotronics before. Um, and syempre, hindi ko naman kilala yung si Hellotronics before. So, hindi ko alam kung may warranty or not. So, ang pagka-explain sa akin, at least for the Xiaomi products, um, at least for Xiaomi products, right? The phones will have uh, some form of warranty based on uh, experts ng Hellotronics. So, Hellotronics mismo nagtitrain and maintain uh, certain technical uh, specialists that will repair and, 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 re and replace parts of your Xiaomi products with official Xiaomi parts. Even though walang official Xiaomi customer center sa Pilipinas. Okay, so Hellotronics has taken upon themselves to come up with an official, uh, a basically an of a pretty official uh, after sale support for Xiaomi products that they sell, even though Xiaomi themselves does not have a physical presence in the Philippines. So that's a that's an interesting, parang semi semi white market approach to launching products. And based from what Sir Ian said, uh, I'm willing to trust him on the fact that they'll they'll uh, they'll service and give you warranty for your Xiaomi products if you buy Xiaomi products from them, which is promising. Na. So that means 
as long as you're not buying from something like Xinfei Yang store like this one and you're buying a Xiaomi product from Hellotronics you should be rest assured at least that they should be, they will they will they will repair your products with parts and, and warranty from from their experts um, at least at the very least they'll they'll do that for you so it's pretty much like having a warranty uh, without without an official service center of Xiaomi <coughs> Tweaking Facebook's layout should be simple for the web design. Alex, yung AOC na monitor na bilimo late lately may anti blue light bayon. I don't think so, dude. Ito yung uh, if you watched yung earlier show, pakita ko ng, ng ng setup. The monitor that I have on my left is the um is the AOC monitor. I've considered using the monitor behind me right here, yung aking Samsung Curve. For my secondary monitor, kaya lang sabi ko, if I'm gonna watch Netflix or something while while in in bed or nakaika, mas gusto ko yung Samsung monitor, right? And the AOC monitor is best talaga as a secondary, not a I know. <coughs> I can't. I don't. I don't want to watch Netflix or or something on the AOC monitor. That's for sure. Um, no, I don't have. A, uh, I don't. I don't think it has blue light filter. Although I haven't really checked. <coughs> Let's see. Um, man, this <laughs> I don't want to wait. Let's see. Uh, oh, I just turned off my monitor. What a great, what a great thing to do. Well, now, now I'm not gonna ex investigate. <laughs> Sorry about that. <clears throat> Dara Samin says phones nowadays are overpriced. Kuya Alex, uh, you po nabili yung anti radiation. Well, they, these are not. These are not anti-radiation, right? These are uh, anti-blue light or, or uh, anti-strain, right? Uh, these are called the Energize, and uh, these are bought from. Uh, let's see, I forgot. I mean, I've, I've answered this before, obviously, pero I forgot na. Um, maybe Rainer, I know. Let's see. These are like from hindi beyond the box eh. Medyo matagal ko nang hina, ginagamit itong glasses na to though. <coughs> For 2000, ito wala 2000 pesos. And let's see. They are Ecotech branches or Eye Studio in Shangri-La Plaza. So they're kind of very weird weirdly <coughs> <coughs> RJ says, "Nakabili ako ng Energize color yellow green effective siya. Yeah, I I like yung ano. I like talaga yung effect niya. It prevents strain talaga, and, and uh, I've been using them quite a lot na. Uh, it ano it lets me. Hindi talaga ano no. Masadong masadong ako nakayo ko pag nandito yung camera. Kasi yung yung TV, eto, eto yung bong yung TV ganyan. So mostly if I read anything on the TV, yung camera naman nandito sa taas. <laughs> yung webcam." That's gonna be a, a problem because I don't, I'm not making eye contact with you guys. Uh, so may energize sa Lazada. Let's look for one. Maganda siya guys. Uh, I, I really like energize. I mean any any blue light uh, glasses siguro. Uh, oh, marami na silang versions dito. I might buy some. Ito siguro yung mga model nung sa akin. Um... Although sa akin is like dark. Ito siguro sa akin, 149. Mag nagmura siya at least. <coughs> Ito yung model nung sa akin, I think. Kasi brown, coffee brown yung sa akin eh. I do, I do have a review of this on video sa YouTube ko if you wanna watch it. Ships from abroad pa? Wow. So... Let's look and see if we can find other digital stra an, ano, anti strain. Um, it prevent if I play like super late in the in the in the evening and stuff like that. Malaking tulong ng energize. Eh. Um, obviously, hindi <laughs> blue light yung hinanap ko taka. Well, well anyway, um, anti strain glasses. They're they're pretty good. They're pretty good. Uh, I gotta give them props for. Being quite nice. 
Maybe I'll buy some another another pro another version. Dalawa lang ata. Ah, may bilog, may bilog, may semi bilog and then may boxy. Yeah, I think eh, semi bilog. Then super bilog. <laughs> ah. At least meron kaysa sa hassle na ipunta mo sa China yung Xiaomi mo. That's true, that's true. Right, so I I like that. And then yun nga eh. So I'm 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 hoping on all hope that Hellotronics brings the Xiaomi Mi A1 sa Pilipinas. Right? It's gonna be it's gonna be super amazing to see um Wow, may unboxing si Unbox Therapy ng Meizu Pro 7. Ma ma copyright tayo kaya lang san saya pa na para na sandali lang. You can configure it however you want. Once you pull down this tray here, you Let's know watch it in 4K even though you can't watch it in 4K. It's a little bit different with the quick settings and so on. So you tap it, it gives Yeah. Okay, so the unit is booted up now. It feels nice and well made. This particular development right here. The, that's where, where, where's the parts where he messes with? Did you see what just with... happened there? Into it. I did a video Sounds on this. Sounds a lot nice. Very... Wait, I've got here when the hell does hands. it mess? Where did he come from? Where did he come from? Back camera. Wait, 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 wait. Sh what's that? Huh? There, there, there. Back, back display. That's what I aim to do here. This is something I haven't seen before, so I absolutely had to check it out. Of course, you are going with a brand that at least North American customers are a lot less familiar with. I think for most people at this particular price point, you're still going to end up with an S8 or some other product from a more recognizable brand. All right. <clears throat> So let's start with uh, what 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 do you want to talk about first? It looks like you're talking about Meizu, ne? I mean, we should start with start with Meizu anyway. <clears throat> Di naman ata power efficient yung Helio X30. What's up, Jim Carl Cerezo? I think I have to settle for now with my Zen 2 Laser and Star Mobile Up Prime. Mo <laughs> Silu talaga. I gotta admit, for somebody who doesn't do shit for uh, for reviews. He just unboxes and makes it look good. Okay. It's like yun yung yun yung si Lu yung idol ni Bibo eh sa totoo lang eh. <laughs> Bakit pala ano yung nasa upper left corner ko? Is that my ah, Meron. What is that on my upper left corner? What is that? Oh, it's a freaking Nakaka OCD. <laughs> Meron akong artwork dun eh. Tanggalin natin siya. I keep seeing it on my peripheral vision and it's annoying the heck out of me. Yung parang it's like a it's like a weird web browser box. Eh. All right, let's get let's get. <laughs> Paka gula lang show nato. What's up, Ate Nyao Nyao? Musta uh, naman after sales ng Meizu at Xiaomi. Actually, we should watch some of their uh, their event. So let's uh, let's turn down the music. I have some footages of their event, um, where one of see Sir Ian Braza was talking about their uh, their after sales support or something like that. Let's see, where is that? Uh, uh, anyway, that's a Meizu topic, na tayo, so we should just start, start with Meizu. Na. Uh, Meizu, Meizu, Meizu. There we go. So, ito yung CA, ito yung... Yeah. In the Philippines, Meizu is exclusively represented by Xingyu International Enterprises Corporation. Uh, just to give you a brief uh, sneak peek yeah, of uh, how Meizu is operating in Europe. For example, in Russia, it started in 2014. So very, very strong market over there with a coverage rate of over 80%. And the presence in... 
May glee lang pala yun. Ano oh, mo pwede nilipakita dito? Introduce the eight new colors. Basic tone of the... Wala, yun lang yun eh. Mm. Kaya na PSC si Kuya Bibs kinain ng live unboxing. Hoy, <laughs> wag kanyang ganyan si B-Boy! <laughs> Ikaw yun. Paboritong paborito ko pa ng mini B-Boy. Ba't ginanyan mo si B-Boy? Sinabi mo kinain ng live unboxing. Uh... At least napansin ni Master Bibs ang CKK. Yeah, if you notice recently si B-Boy is working with uh, brands like Torque, mga ganun. He's doing live unboxings for Napansin niyo ba ba 'yon? Uh, nung after nung Meizu, pumunta pa siya ng Torque para mag-unboxing. Hanapin natin na eh. Torque. Tapos may may live stream din siya with Lazada and stuff like that. So he's he's doing I, I don't know what you call it, brand integration. <laughs> I don't, I, you know, my picture funny vivo, you know. Um, he, at least, I know, at least he's was working for his to, to his strengths ng konte. Ah, uh, naga, ito yung kanyang core core skill set kaya eh, yun unboxing live, eh. ni ba? Ano tawag dito? I mean, tra, ano yan? Maganda yan. So parang he, he gets a he gets a good paying job. Or not a good job, but contractual, uh, ano yan, yung parang uh, uh, sideline na lang, or, or uh, what do you call this? Racket, racket yan, racket. Oh, tapos, uh, yung core competency nyo dyan, di ba? Good live streaming, good host for live streaming, cha-cha-cha. So, at least meron na siyang, meron na siyang na-carve na niche para sa sarili niya, di ba? Um, that's pretty good. Sobrang hit po. Nang Pro 7 kung Snapdragon yun kahit 820 ayos na ayos Sabi ni Jordan de Chavez Hey, what's up Kuya Jordan? Ang ating winner ng <laughs> Asus Zen Power Slim GHK, GHNK na lang kulang ni B-Boy <laughs> Hindi ba flagship price yung Pro 7? Uh, so let's talk about the Pro 7, right? So actually, merong video ba si B-Boy nito? Alam ko may video si B-Boy nito Nakawin natin yung video ni B-Boy Para may iba naman tayo, hindi yung video ko, ba? Yung video ko, in-upload ko sa Facebook kasi hindi siya, ano, hindi siya bagay sa YouTube ngayon. Tsaka, po, tsaka, wala namang kwenta Facebook, eh, YouTube ngayon. Uh, Pinoy screencast. Desi, ano ba to? May, may video ba siya ng Meizu? Wala ata. Wala siyang video ng Meizu? Tamad. Tamad. Walang kwenta. Ah... Uh, Kuya Bibs with the Notice Me Senpai Brigade Overpriced Meizu 7 Pro At least nga 100% nagbabalik si Kuya Bibs Kaya ayan improved Alright, so let's just watch my video na lang from Meizu um, Even though napanood nyo na siguro to uh, uh, This is Hey, what's up? <laughs> Nakakaasar lang 720p lang ni render ko Kasi para sa Facebook yung Facebook yung target ko dito eh Ang inang Facebook yan, kabwisit 720p video some poach. Hey, what's up guys? Alex here from TechnoClash.com. Today we're going on a super far trip down to Sofitel uh, to attend a Meizu event. Two hours later. The front camera is 16 megapixels. With not at 200 after. We give it a nice smart algorithm to let you can... Ang hirap intindihin ni Kuya eh. Fast Ang hirap intindihin ni Kuya, kaya may ano daw ako yun. Ang smart algorithm to let you can take no future. Fast-point screen, so hard display. 3000 mAh battery with 80 watt faster charging. Digital print identification. Hi-Fi music. And uh, flying music based, based on Android 7. With such great specification, what surprise is it? Pro 7 is comes to Philippines and 22,000 pesos. Yeah, so yan ang price. So, um, I see some complaints, obviously. Uh, you know, some of them are good. Some of them are correct. Some of them are not for the pricing. Uh, this is the first product. The first version, the 22,990 has a, the Helio P25, right? So, not necessarily such a good ano ba to P25 
Mm. Whatever, it's a Helio P20, kind of, like an upgraded Helio P20. Ito yung aking comments. <coughs> Ngongi. Shishi. Naalala ko yung Spongebob to alert <laughs> two hours later na yun. <laughs> Power. <laughs> to satisfy your higher demands. Kasi two hours naman talaga yung basahe ko papunta ron, di ba? Haba, layo-layo na sa hospital sa amin. The price of it is 31,990. Now, okay, so let's differentiate between the two. The 22,990 has a Helio P25, full HD display, 5.2 inch, and I believe 3,000 milliampere battery. The 31,990 version... Has a Helio X30 Helio X30 Power <laughs> Helio X30 um, Quad HD display 5.7 inch AMOLED And then uh, Hindi ko alam yung baterya Pero definitely mas malaki yung baterya niya You can visit our retail stores In SMO Or visit our Visit Hell Toys In Lazada my eyes burn. <laughs> this is the plus variant with the 5.7 inch AMOLED display sa likod. Uh, in steps ang galing yun. Galing sa kubaw. And ito yung number one yung parang bagong feature with the Heli the, the Meizu Pro 7. Meron siyang AMOLED display sa likod. I don't know. The, I'm not sure of the resolution, but it looks pretty good. It's also a touchscreen sa likod. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> and then, uh, makita nyo po, meron siyang AMOLED display sa likod uh, Hindi lang po weather, weather lang ang pinapakita nyan Tsaka steps Meron po yung camera So, pag binuksan natin yung camera Hindi ako updated Huwag ka nga dito, kalit telepono mo Tapos, pupunta kami, manggugulo kami 3, 2, 1 Ay, hindi nakapokus yung aking camera Bulok Bulok yung camera ko, hindi nakapokus eh Yun, Yun. so the other function ng AMOLED display is pwede siyang viewfinder for your camera thus allowing you to take shots, uh, selfie shots without using the selfie uh, sensor The selfie sensor nitong camera na to has a 16 megapixel sa harap, right? And then, the lawan 12 megapixel, yes, so 2 mega, uh, two double lens na rin siya uh, Ang tawag ko ngayon dyan sa technology na yan is composite lens, uh, katulad ng Huawei uh, 2 times 12 megapixels uh, Babasa mo pa yung, ano, yung IMA, sen IMA numbers dito <laughs> Sa sobrang linaw Even though Butangin na 720p lang tong video na to Dahil for Facebook lang ang production ko uh, uh, Sa akin hindi ako makapag-complain May konting reason ability Mahal, he, pahirap Hashtag power Nya, mas overpriced pa sila Papala si Meizu kaya sa Kaysus Power. Um, so yeah, you know, meron siyang meron siyang viewfinder sa likod if you want to use the display, the AMOLED display sa likod. And then dalawa yung lenses niya sa likod. The, the two lenses are both 12 megapixel. Um, and if I'm not mistaken, hindi sila optically stabilized. So it's a uh, ang 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 gusto ko dito is number one, Meizu is doing something original. That's that's one thing. Uh, number two, the design is very nice, very high end, but also very different from other companies. So that in itself, I like what Meizu is doing. In terms of the price, I think twenty two or well twenty three in it, twenty two nine ninety for the the Helio P twenty five. Medyo sak saklap lang because you're getting a se somewhat low end processor Helio P. Helio P25 is like a 15, maybe maximum 15,000 peso phone, right? Um, but yun nga, ang binabayaran mo kasi dito is yung technology na super, yung AMOLED sa likod, AMOLED sa harap, the design, and... Oh, masyado malakas yung volume ng ating music, hindi naman. Yan, baba natin ang konti. Yung binabayaran mo dito is yung AMOLED sa likod, yung dual lenses, and the design, and whatnot. Uh, which I think is, to a certain extent, warranted naman. It's it's a good design. It's a good innovation in the space, right? Ang, ang nakakatuwa dito is the fact that since you already have a display on the back, para saan pa yung 16 megapixel selfie camera mo, di ba? Um, I know mas maraming megapixels yung, 
yung camera mo sa harap. But we're talking about a main camera here versus a selfie camera. Kung ako papapiliin mo, doon ako magmi -main, sa main camera. And because meron tayong display ngayon sa likod, right? Uh, ang ang mangyayari niyan is at least pwede tayong excuse me. <laughs> I just burped. Pwede tayong kumuha ng selfie without using the selfie camera. Um, it's crazy that we have this technology now where we Kung ako yan, kung, kung for example yung HTC 10 go. Uh, if I had if I had a, a display on the back of my HTC 10, I would shoot 100% on the back of the HTC 10, not the front of the HTC 10. Um, para I, I can see where I'm shooting, I can see what I'm shooting, right? Um, without, you know, without kasi pag, pag nag-vlog ako, ganito yan, naka-selfie mode ako, eh, right? Ang selfie nito is 1080. It still looks very good. I know you've been seeing my vlogs recently. The HTC 10 produces some incredible video. And this is shot by the HTC 10 as well, by the way. Um, so, the HTC 10 has proven itself. However, um, if I were given a choice, I would shoot me the main camera all the time because of the 4K capabilities and stuff like that. Anyway, my point, uh, my point being, this display in the back has has potential and touchscreen din siya sa likod, so giving it some extra potential as well. However, hindi ko lang alam how much people are gonna use it for the informational part of the display because generally people just look at the front of their phones for weather, for notifications and stuff like that. I don't know why they would turn their phone around just to see the back of their phone to see some notifications and stuff. I don't know if that's gonna be an interesting thing or not. But regardless, it is a very cool feature na lang. Let's call it a very cool feature na lang. <clears throat> Sami ni Rainer Lizada. All I want in my phone now is big battery and two gigs of RAM. No need for the fancy stuff. So, uh, let's go. Taasa naman natin yung yung ano natin. Gawin mo namang three gigs of RAM, uh, Rainer Lizada. Uh, benta rin tayo ng kidney or mag networking para makabili tayo ng mga flagship phones ngayon. Ha, power. Meizu display on the back, payabang. Mag, pag meron kang ganyan, ha, alam na, payabang, payabang. <laughs> Alright, so. Yun na nga, um, this cost, this cost 23k. Um, ang masasabi ko na lang dito is, if, if the 12 megapixel dual camera, composite camera, proves itself, proves itself to be a good setup, if the quality is as good as, say, the, the Huawei P9, which I have back here, um, then, eh, may, I think it's a pretty good, it's a pretty good play into the space where it's super crowded and they're differentiating themselves in the in the space, which is nice. Um, the design is, like I said, I like the design, uh, personally. You know, it's, it's gonna, it's gonna, if they had like a Snapdragon 625 dito, medyo, medyo ano pa eh, medyo matindi pa, medyo super ganda pa siguro nito eh. Although, some people don't really mind that much processor wise. They just want a selfie selfie or a cool phone. This is a cool phone overall. Um, time will tell if people are gonna gravitate towards this back display thing. I know it's maybe a novelty so much, uh, a little bit, but novelty sometimes co goes a long way. Um, but yeah, that's that's all we got from Meizu. I guess we don't have a lot of... Uh, didn't Wasn't able to do any tests, wasn't able to... Uh, you know, do do any specific. Wala ba akong, wala ba akong website ng Mazo? Here we go. Bakit ganit? Bakit finet? Ano to? Bakit English naman to? Ah? Bakit finet rin? Ano meron? Um, Bitcoin mayan tayo for more money. Hashtag power. Masasabi ko early pa, so okay lang na sila na una sa black, back screen. Eh, it's, it's fine. Look at this design though. It, it's really nice, I have to admit. Finetre, what the fuck is a Finetre display? Continuous innovation is with me. The Finetre display of the Meizu 7 Pro makes it real. A stunning AMOLED screen combined with a matching UI brings an all new. Learn more about this stupid thing that we're calling Finetre fucking display. What the fuck is that term? Hmm. 
What the fuck is a finite? Are you just making shit up? Okay, meron sh <laughs> Ito yung mga information na makikita mo sa FINETRE DISPLAY <laughs> Why, What the fuck is a FINETRE DISPLAY? Okay, so th they do have this extra feature na you can turn it into a a dumb MP3 player, not a dumb. I mean, like a, a basic MP3 player without uh, Wi-Fi, without Bluetooth, without whatever. If you wanna, parang use your Meizu uh, Pro 7s uh, airplane um, without using yung data and stuff like that. Uh, it's an interesting feature, though. I don't think it's that important to have. Although, gotta admit, this this look, this parang hindi ganito yung dating ng ano ng phone ng ginawa ka namin, but. It seems like they brushed metal shot, but the phone we were looking looking at didn't have. Let, wait long, wait long, wait long, wait long, wait long. See this <laughs> bottle? This is not okay. This is not the same design. Uh, one of the last shots. This one, Bayon? Yeah. Po, mga kuya. Okay. So, ba maling maling yung design sa oh, website nila kaysa sa sa kaysa this, uh, no? sa actual units. This is not brushed metal. Look at this. This is just uh, regular no texture metal on the back. Versus sa website nila, merong brush. You know? They lied to us. You know, may brush dito. That's weird. Ay, yung binabayaran mo, yung finet... Ay, nasan sila nang hanap ng bird na finet display Yun yung binabayaran mo, mga kuya. Y uh, I, I have to be honest, the... It's... Uh, it's... Yung... Nakakatuwa lang siya. Na the, for example, Meizu is one of the first brands that are doing quad, quad HD on their phones. Nauna pang nauna pang mag Quad HD si Meizu kaysa kay Asus for some reason. Anyway. Uh, gawin na lang kasi nila na parehong pareho yung rear and front camera tapos pareho may OIS. Yeah, uh, it, it's a little bit harder to do that for front camera. Mas maliit kasi yung module na pwede mo lagayan. But depende sa depende sa gina I mean, may mga camera, may mga phones talaga na malaki talaga yung Yung noo, para malaki talaga yung camera sa harap. Uh, yung Coca Mobile, di ba may black screen dis black back screen display for ebooks? <laughs> Payabang ang puta. Tang ina to sa Vixoto pa more. Tang ina O plus ang puta ng Vixoto na yun. Tapos naging Cherry Mobile na ngayon. Fact shit. Alright, let's move on. Uh, that's the Meizu 7 Pro 7. Um, I think. I, I have to give Meizu props for experimenting for a really cool looking design, right? And the, the back screen really does look awesome. I'm not sure if it's worth the extra money. Uh, generally, siguro the most you would pay with for a phone like that would be around uh, 15 nga talaga. Um, for adding 8,000 more is a little bit much. But, you know, some people have the money and are attracted to some things like that. So, it, it, it's it, we're not here to judge, right? I like the fact that they're going with uh, the the Quad HD display, although hindi pa rin sila nag uh, Snapdragon processor. Sadly, um, dun sa, sa thirty two thousand peso nila na Meizu Pro Seven Plus. Um, I like that it's a five point seven inch Quad HD display. I like that there's a front cam front display or a back display na AMOLED. 32K is a little bit much. And then, uh, sabi ni Norms, nag-iisa pa din ata ang HTC, HTC 10 OIS sa front cam. I think Sony has a... Dito ako na-correct nung isang araw. Sony has a... Sony has a camera that has a phone that has front camera OIS. Um, this one. Uh, let's let's just click the first one. with So, nakakatawa dito. Sony has a camera... Uh, has a phone... XA Ultra with the OIS front cam, but the rear cam still doesn't have OIS. So XA Ultra. Nagatawa kasi po siya. Priorities ni ni Sony yung front cam OIS versus the rear cam OIS. Like I don't understand what Sony does sometimes, talaga. 
Look at this. Okay. So the the primary cam of the Sony Xperia XA Ultra has 21 megapixel face detection, autofocus, LED flash, and blah 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 blah. One over 2.4 inch sensor size, pretty good. But no OIS. But on the secondary camera, which is the front camera, you have a one a, a 16 megapixel, one over 2.6 inch sensor size, OIS camera. So why not so? Why? Why not both? You're the only brand that seems to have gotten it backwards. Everybody's doing back camera OIS. And Sony, in their great mind, has never ever done OIS before. And this is the first time nagka OIS sila. Nilagay nila sa harap. Nilagay nila sa harap. Imbis sa likod. Imbis na both. God damn. What kind of misguided thing is that? Ano yun? Sell, ano lang? Vlogging mode lang? Forever? Damn, dude. Such weirdness, man. Alright, let's get to some of the topics here. I like the Android one. Uh, ito, wala sa Pilipinas ito. We don't know if it's coming to the Philippines or not. But I'm super excited about this one. Um, yung... Yung pagka-unique ni Meizu Pro 7 reminds me of the new unique camera design ng Oppo dati yung N1 at N3 iba yun yung swivel yes so that's a cool feature although hindi sila hindi na ano hindi it didn't catch on so much ginaya siya ng I think torque uh, but it didn't catch on so much pang kokak vlad siya si XA Ultra I know na hindi sila hindi nila alam ito ang actual kokak vlogs machine the HTC 10 diba this guy, this guy right here, this guy is the vlogging machine, man. Ano talaga? Eh, medyo confident na ako. I'm very confident to say that if you're gonna start vlogging and uh, in in the and even in the Philippines, this is a this is the best vlogging camera you can ever buy, especially if you vlog in the Philippines, right? Number one. Wala, in, tang, ano dito eh Galit yung mga tao sa mga tao na naghawak ng mga camera na Yung, hey guys, what's up? I'm in the mall Putangin na, sir, bawal po dito yan Gaganunin ka ng mga secure, ba The HTC 10 is an amazing phone And allows you to vlog Even handheld Alam nyo naman, nakita nyo yung mga Coca plugs ko It's really, 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 really good for, for vlogging um, in such a way that all you need is an external microphone, which I do. You should watch the vlogs. You should watch yung mga vlogs ko. You should watch yung mga ano ko. It's it's an amazing quality for for what it's what it's doing, what it is. Hindi ko alam kung gagawa ako ng video or not, but I I think I will. Eh, pag nag nagkaroon ako ng oras. But then again, it's a, such a small. It's such a small ano, eh, such a small niche market that. Parang, hey, are you gonna uh, you wanna be vlogging or you wanna be videoing yourself? Anyway, uh, let's move on to the Xiaomi. Nyao Nyao said, my bo my friend bought an Xperia, pero not sure kung XA will try X way X1. Lol, meron bang X1? <laughs> uh, I think that's a XA1. <laughs> XA1. Bakit tar baka target ni Sony mga selfie people? That's why my friend bought it. Yeah, I mean they they do target selfie a little bit. Kaka vlog is packing on power. <laughs> may naka DSLR pa nga yun yung isa papuntang SM. I know, may mga ganun talaga. I attended. So, hindi ko, hindi ko ginawa ng video. I don't know if I have the raw files pa. I probably deleted it already. Uh, let's see. Um, no, it's probably not here anymore. It's uh, MSI. No. Oh, ano yung Asus dapat yun eh? No, I didn't uh, I attended yung Asus Zenfone live launch and they invited a bunch of vloggers. Tang ina, nakaka ano? It's so fucking it's like na mahihiya ka, mahihiya ka na maging vlogger. It's so and dami mga hipster shit. I mean, I'm sorry sa mga hipster shit that vlog, ha, pero yung style talaga nila eh. Let's let's find the selfie stick here somewhere. Ito na lang, let's use my my gimbal. Ano talaga? As in, 
I, I'm okay with vlogging, but I don't want to be associated with a bunch of vapid teenager shits. No, no, no. Hey, right, guys, we're here now. So, no, hi. Oh, my God. I'm so happy. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> um... And they're gonna lose They're just fucking parang ganon. Ah, dito na tayo. Hey, guys. Woo! Yeah. Ew, no. And it's back. Behind me is the plan. Tak. Ina sabi ko na kaya. Na kaya. Ayo. Ayo ko masosyit sa mga taong ganyan. Walang walang wala atang ano wala atang punto sa buhay. Uh, um. So. I was there. There's a bunch of yung parang mga hipster people with with uh, either try and generally yung yung they copy yung Casey Neistat na may gorilla pad and then may camera sa harap na selfie mode yung camera with a flip up display. Either DSLR yan na may uh, may uh, what do you call this with a with a shotgun mic lang mga road microphones or something like that. Or sometimes yung mga point and shoot lang na may flip up display. That's the, and then may may microphones sila. They they're they're tech, uh, mechanically or, or equipment wise they're perf they correct sa, sa choices nila. But I just think, damn, I, it's I I just fe- I just thought it was sad. It was really sad. Uh. Shami M on A1, M, uh, me A1 would be selling hotcakes here in the Philippines if someone sells it and the price is reasonable. Lager stand naman daw si Nyao Nyao. Uh, Stick to pa rin ba ang vlogging sa loob ng mall? I would say yes. Mahirap, mahirap pa rin na... Uh, th- hindi lang yun eh. Right, so... I don't know if you've seen some, uh, some, uh, some of my Kohak vlogs. I... The reason why sobrang dali with, with the phone is because people are... Hindi na sila na wiwirduhan pag gumanong ka lang eh. Like okay, yeah. I mali naka, naka front camera ako. Naka main camera pala ako. So mali lang saving video. So I would just plug I was just I would just plug in my my microphone, right? And then yeah, ganun ko lang siya, parang i check lang ako ng buhok ng konti and then mag pinutin ko siyang ganun. Hello mga kuya, what's up? And then we'll vlog tayo today, blah 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 blah. And then, kahit yung mga tao, kahit may mga tao, magugulat na lang sila. And then they're just, ah okay, this guy is just an idiot trying to, to record the selfie video. Whatever, it's some, some dumbass. So ganun, blah 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 blah, cha 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 And then tapos na ako, mga 15 seconds. It's a, it's in, it's out, it's very quick. There's no like setup na parang, tangin na, sinong gago to may hawak na selfie stick? Diba? May gorilla pad, hawak-hawak. Naglalakad si si Kong ganun eh, di ba? Nakagorilla pa diyan or whatever. May meron pa siyang kap- kapatid niya, dinadala niya pa para mag-vlog eh. May maraming pera eh. So it's not always practical na lang. It's not always practical to vlog with a with a DSLR and ano. Uh and for me, I can't do it because I have to bring so much stuff and sometimes you just go places eh. You just... Paano kung kumakain ka lang sa McDo? Dadali mo yung DSLR mo. Kumakain tayo sa McDo. Ha ha ha! Power! Gago! Ha ha Power! Gago! Ha ha <laughs> So... Sa ASUS live event, andun si Kong TV dun, di ba? Ha ha Power. Yeah, ganun. Uh, so, uh, let's talk about the Xiaomi M... Uh, Mi... Mi A1, right? So... You may be right, Brian Acabado. You may be wrong. Kasi, okay, so... Let me tell you a story about the uh, Cherry Mobile Android One G1 and the Cherry Mobile Flip X. Cherry Mobile launched a very, very good phone. Uh, both very good phones, the Flare X and the uh, Android One G1. Uh, and so, sobrang there are just some dumb people, really, that made the Flare X more popular. Then the Android One G1. There's completely misguided idiots who preferred my higher specs over updated software and stock software. And the problem is they voted with their money or they voted with buying this bullshit product that doesn't get updates, right? So historically, I'm gonna tell you this historically. The Filipino people are idiots because they bought the Flare X over the Android One G1. So, yung sinasabi mo na yan na 
would be selling like hotcakes here in the Philippines if someone sells it and the price is reasonable. I don't think that's true. Because Filipinos are idiots. I'm sorry. Okay, so not all Filipinos. But I'm just saying the voting power or the money voting power of the people go to the Flare X instead of the Android 1G1. And that's why Android 1 died originally. Because there were not enough people buying Android 1 devices. I know nakaubos sila, but they didn't make enough. Diba? So what happened now is that Google said, ah, okay, they'll just, we'll just stop Android 1, Android 1 products. It's a good thing that, 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 that Xiaomi is now trying to make a new one. But ang niyan is the Mi A1, even if it released in the Philippines, in the Philippines, what if nagkaroon ng bago si whatever, whatever shit brand? And it's a Flare X 2.0. Will we be smart enough to buy the Android 1 product over the Flare X 2.0? Because historically, binili natin yung Flare X. Even though hindi tayo yun. And yung, I know for a fact, si Nyao nyo, naka Android 1 yan and stuff like that. Or at least recently. Si Rana ata. We need more people supporting Android 1. That's all. Kasi meron talagang mga tanga. I'm sorry. Nabibili ng hindi Android 1. Magre-reklamo sila sa group nila. Ay, bakit hindi? Bakit, mar, ano pa rin ako? Uh, lollipop pa rin ako. Ano, cherry mo ba? Ba't wala akong update pa? May bloatware ako. Hey! Tanga, ba't binili mo? Tanga. May review na sa harap mo. Umurahin nung pwede review. Well. Tanga na bayaran ka siguro. Fuck you. <laughs> Gago! <laughs> Yun na gagawin. <laughs> Gago! <clears throat> Overkill masyadong DSLR, mas better phone na lang. Yeah, that's true. And phones are getting better all the time. I think HTC 10 is really a good number. And good good point in the vlog, in your vlogging career where it's super good quality now. Uh, sabi ni Norms, not all uh, pero sa mga, sa masang Filipino sa mga Flare X. Isip minsan may ads, artist <laughs> shirt. Shit, ayan, bili na. Yeah, that's true, that's true. Sorry, nanguya ako ng yellow, sorry. Unsolicited advice lang sa Flare X users, sa dami ng lindo na nangyayari mo ngayon. Magbago na kayo. What the heck? <laughs> Sina mo, sinali mo pa yung lindol. Nung isang araw, may nabasa ako sa Lazada na comment. Tinatanong kung Octa or Deca core yung Note 4 na yun. Masusto daw kasi ang Deca. Damn! Kuya, konti na lang bumibili sa... Sa Kokak Mobile. I know, I know. Konti na lang. So, let's talk about the Mi A1. And uh, I'm really happy that Xiaomi picked up the Android 1... Uh, product line again um, because number one ayong ay, ayaw na ayaw ko yung ano eh, ayaw na ayaw ko yung skin ng Xiaomi I, I have a Xiaomi product here that I need to review yung in-unbox natin nung isang araw nakakatawa ang tagal niya rin ano eh ang tagal niya naka-on yung battery <laughs> ngayon naka namatay na siya because wala nung battery but ang tagal ding buhay nito eh so if I can get a Xiaomi phone in the Xiaomi build quality, the Xiaomi quality of, of produ uh, production and all that, but it has no Xiaomi UI, it has stock Google UI with constant or, or official updates out of the box rollout, talagang instant. Fuck yeah, that's like a dream phone, pretty much, right? It's like. It's like getting an Android 1G, Cherry Mobile Android 1G1, except gawa ni Xiaomi. Putang ina, yes! Fuck yes! Look at that! Ang ganda niya tingnan! It looks like a fucking iPhone. Tangalin na sa loop. So, let's talk about the Android Mi, Mi A1, right? So, here it is. Perfect, picture perfect dual camera. Dual camera pa siya. So, it's uh, in R15K. For, for I don't know how much that translates. I think that's 12,000 pesos at that. Um, yeah, in INR to INR. Okay, so it's about twelve thousand pesos, right? So this is a a uh, Android one Android one device for twelve thousand pesos. 
strictly converted diretso ah. Hindi natin alam kung magkano darating sa Pilipinas if ever darating siya sa Pilipinas. But maganda yung mga conversion uh, prices ngayon ah, just in case ah. So nakaka-inspire ngayon yung mga look at the Xiaomi na pinapasok ni Hellotronics, ang ganda ng ang competitive ng prices. Si Infinix competitive ng prices and stuff like that. So very promising. I really hope I dapat talaga nung nasa event ako ni ano ni Meizo nagtanong ako kung merong an- actually nandito naman yung nandito naman yung email ni Sir Ian eh <laughs> kulitin natin So we have the Mi A1 look at that design it actually looks really nice honestly I think it's a really nice design it does copy the iPhone a little bit but holy crap I don't care but meron pa rin akong background. May background pa rin akong gumagalaw. Ano tong gumagalaw sa likod ko? Ah, hindi. Ano lang pala yung web browser. Yung... Meron pala gumagalaw sa likod dito. Okay. So, we have a flagship dual camera. 2 times optical zoom. So, 2 times zoom yung isang lens. We have a full 5.5 inch full HD display. Full metal body created by Xiaomi. Powered by Google. Right? So, flagship dual camera. 2 12 megapixel camera. Isang wide, isang telephoto. 2 times optical zoom yung isa, yung telephoto. And then the pixels are 1.25 micron, which is decent, decent. <coughs> the, Mi M1, uh, the Mi A1 dual camera is more than a set of power. It's a complete experience. Snap a photo, apply fixes, then upload the photo. So, ang, nakaka- ang gusto ko ang nakakatawa lang dito is sobrang fake nung ano yung shots eh. Look at, the, look at the beautification and smoothening on these ladies right here and this lady right here. Wala na siyang pores. I know, baka hindi masyado makita sa, ano, sa live stream. But pero alam pores yung mga atin na to. She's very pretty, but she's got no pores. Okay? Fingerprint resistant back. Uh, 7.3 millimeters. That's amazing. 7.3 millimeters. May price na si Widget. Wait, 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 wait. Seryoso? Yan Uh, Xiaomi Xiaomi <clears throat> What do you got? What do you got? Um, ano to? Mi A1 Wala eh, walang lumili to eh Ingatin Widget City Xiaomi Mi A1 <clears throat> Wala naman ah. I can't find it. If you have a link uh, surprise sa Widget City, let me know. I'm, uh, baka hindi ko lang mahanap. Uh, fingerprint resistant discrete separation line. So it's like an iPhone now. Yung antenna ba niya nasa taas. Full metal body. It looks nice. Look at these logos and shit. It's so minimalistically nice. Uh, the fingerprint scanner is still in the back. Which is fine. Uh, curved glass display. Absolutely gorgeous. Blah, 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 blah. We got a Snapdragon 625. Good choice. Good choice. Think about it. A 12 12K peso phone. Snapdragon 625. Android 1. 4 gigs of RAM. Woo! That's so good. Ang tanong ko lang kung may micro SD. But, you know, it's fine. Uh, smart power amplifier. What it's uh, Clearer calls. Uh, top and bottom man. Okay, fine. Yeah. So, all-in-one experience. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, dual camera, 4 gigs, Snapdragon 625, 3,080 mAh battery. Oh, yun. So, ano siya? Hybrid SIM, SIM tray. So, dalawang, dalawang nano SIM or one mic, isang nano SIM, isang micro SD. And then, meron siyang IR blaster for some reason. Nobody uses that anymore, but meron siyang IR blaster if you want it. <coughs> ano pa ba pwede natin tignan ito? Let's click on the dual camera. Come on, load. So, we're, we're reading this, uh, the... Xiaomi India site right now. Sometimes it's so nice to be to live in India, siguro no. Siguro kung tag India no, kung dami ng subs- more than two hundred thousand subscribers na siguro ko. Hindi ako nag tang ina. Hindi siguro ako nag cherry mobile shit, no? Ito yung this is gonna be the budget ane eh, p- pixel ane eh, pixel phone eh, pretty much eh. Ang ganda ng design, dual lenses. This is the budget pixel. Ang guapo. I like the black. Although, damn. I don't know. If they had another color like blue, I would love it. Ayoko ng pink, of course. Sorry, ah. <laughs> can't, can't do pink. 
Pute? What's the white one? Ah, oh, that's the pink. Textured case. Oh, textured case. Never mind. Uh, and that's it. Uh, I think that was, that's um, me A1. So it's gonna be around 12,000 pesos if ever somebody brings it to the Philippines. <coughs> I'm getting some notifications. I don't know what for. Maybe something... Alright, I thought related to the topic. Eh. <coughs> Lalatiin na naman yun mga player excuses. <laughs> Wait lang, medyo, ma ano, medyo mabagal ako magbasa ng mga comments ngayon, hindi ako ano. Let's see, uh, bro ko masaya naman sa Redmi 4X. I have a Redmi, ano ba ito, 4X na, ano ba ito, 3 gigs? Or, I forget kung ano yung unbox ko nung isang araw. Gamot para sa... Ga, Plerex gamot para sa matinding ubo. <laughs> Plerex ang gamot ng... Uh, Ate Nyao Nyao, what do you feel about your uh, your Asus Zenfone 3? And how how bloat... <laughs> how do you feel about your bloat? <laughs> Junching, what's up? Ang, ang aking... Sub, ma, ma... Tibay na taga subaybay sa Facebook. Um, Farmer Sanchez kung 13.5k ang Mi 5X dito based on Mi A1 mas mataas kaya Mi A1 or mas mababa I don't know uh, Kuya San pa kayo pa kaya ako makakabili ng Xiaomi Mi Pad 1 yung Tigro K1 Jun Ching I don't know why you would want the Mi Pad 1 anymore medyo napapaglumaan na yung Tigro K1 uh, sa totoo lang although if you want um, de hindi rin eh mahal kasi Let's go to OLX. Um, see, ano ba to? Nvidia Tigra Shield and Nvidia Shield na lang, right? Eto Tigra to eh. Um, mahal pa rin no? Dapat less than ten thousand na to eh, pero kinsi mil pa rin sa you sa Pilipinas. Eto, eto ano to eh? Basically, ito yung processor ng Processor to ng ano. Eh, bakit may power strip dito? This is the processor and same ng with the uh, Xiaomi. I wouldn't suggest getting getting the uh, the, the uh, ano to? Pangalan na ulit nun? Mi Pad 1. Uh, sa Farmer Sanchez, so pag nakabili ako ng Mi A1, isa na akong A1 user. Wale, ha? Anong isa mo yung A1 user? A1 kasi. Wait natin sa black market. Bibili si Madobi niya 24th phone niya na. 24th phone niya na. Dang. Farmer Sanchez, question pala. Mas okay ba bili ng M Mi A1? Pucha, yung M1A1 talaga yung... Na, 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 lagi kong nasasabi M1A1 eh. Mi A1 over the Zenfone 3 standard since hindi sila, hindi sila magkakalayo ng price. Magandang tanong yan. Naka Zenfone 3 ako, hello. Um, <laughs> there... There's that's two train of thoughts kasi. So Magkalapit nga sila so to let's see ano. So 3000 milliamp hour battery, Snapdragon 625, full HD display 5.5 pareho pareho, right? Um uh, pareho silang bakal yung katawan and stuff like that, may fingerprint sensor. Um 4 gigs of RAM as well. That's a very good question. Now, I know for a fact that the the Zenfone 3 uh, has a very very good camera the 16 megapixel main camera even though it's just one lens uh, the 16 megapixel camera is very very good um dito we have one point know, wide angles 12 megapixel no 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 oas and then another 12 megapixel with two times zoom or two times uh fixed zoom fixed uh fixed lens right so I think it all comes down to two things, right? Ha, your bloatware situation, number I, your, the, the amount of bloatware or the amount of software updates that you want, and if you want an optically stabilized rear camera or not. So yun ang, yun ang dalawang options mo. So if you really, really, really have to have 4K stabilized video, go for the Zenfone 3. But I think for a lot more people, and in my personal opinion, if I'm just going to buy one of these and I'm not going to use it for video, which is sadly hindi ko gagawin because I need video, I would go with the 
uh, Xiaomi M, Mi A1. 100%. If anybody asks me today na parang hindi naman sila video person, uh, Mi A1 or Zenfone 3, I would go Mi A1. Uh, number one, amazing build, right? It's super thin, ang lilit ng bezels. Xiaomi makes... Look at this guy. Look at this design, man. Ang guapo niya, ang minipis. Oh, ang nipis. 7.3 millimeters is no joke, guys. Malit yung bezels niya. Um, ganda ng design, bakal everywhere and stuff like that. Um, okay, let's do this. I think the Xiaomi wins in the design department. I think the Xiaomi wins in the software department. Um, guaranteed win, uh, guaranteed updates as well. So panalo siya dun. The only time an analysis si, the si Zenfone is with the 4K camera or at least main camera na lang. Kasi 12 megapixels is still a low resolution talaga. Um, if you're really comparing talaga, comparing as in one is to one comparison between 12 megapixel and 16 megapixel, malikita mo talaga yung difference. Unless na lang nagpost ka lang ng low quality picture sa, sa Facebook, right? Or Instagram, hindi mapapansin. But if I'm to, kung ako yung tumingin ng difference between 12 and 16, kitang kita ko yung difference. Kasi nagzo-zoom in ako eh. Um, so, if you ask me, M Mi A1 hands down, unless you're doing video uh, video work. Yun na lang. Um, kasi, ang masakit dito is yung sobrang bloated na Asus user, user interface, especially nung Zenfone 3 era. And, um, uh, super, yeah, walang, hindi, ka, hindi ka garantisan. Super bloated UI, uh, super bloated, lots of apps ni Asus, and then, medyo luma na yung design ng, ng Zen UI kasi, it's so ugly. Uh, di ko na lang di ko na lang pinapansin yung bloat ng Zenfone 3 ko <laughs> alright um, I'm about to ask if Zenfone versus A1 stock Android all the way yes that's yeah, stock Android all the way talaga that's why I love my HCC 10 um, even though even so even though HCC in their stupid ass brains decided kailangan ko ng touch pal keyboard <laughs> Yun lang yung ano nila, yun lang katangahan ni HCC stock pa, uh, touch pal keyboard. I, and then, okay, so let's move on now. Let's move on to the next topic, which is very interesting now. Is, it's very possible. I don't know if you've read this or not. HTC might be bought by Google. <laughs> My mind is blown. <clears throat> So this is this might be like the best thing ever to happen to HTC and to me for me that is sobrang Motorola boy ako kasi dahil they were bought by Google and and they really were uh, an amazing company that builds amazing phones same story with HTC HTC might be the same amazing company that big, makes amazing phones and now might be bought by Google so this is a report from a uh, Taiwanese news site and then convert ko na lang to English, right? Uh, it, it's very hard to read but it basically here the the gist of the news story is HTC smartphone uh, smartphone division of HTC might be bought by Google. I don't know where what their source is or what their what is. Um, let's see. It is understood that Google is a, st is a strategy to invest or buy HTC smartphone R&D team to discuss the matter. The negotiators have entered the final stage. The slowest will be the completed by end of the year. So Google might be buying HTC by the end of the year. <coughs> I don't know if this is true or not. This could be fake news, but I'm really hoping it's true. <laughs> I want to buy a, a, an HTC Google phone. So yun lang gusto ko ang point ko dun, eh. Um, it's gonna be biblical. It's gonna be epic if we can find. If I could get like a an, an HTC with the stock Android all over again, man. Balik 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 loob na ako sa HTC. Also, bumalik na si HTC sa Pilipinas. So all the better, right? It's it's gonna be the 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 good times are back again, right? The good times, good old days are back again. HTC is back in the game, making good phones again. Not some bullshit with squeezy squeezy bullshit. <clears throat> but, uh, what the specs? What do you mean AMR AMRO? What do you mean? Do you need, do you need to know the specs of the the Xiaomi? 
Bakit ngayon bibili na ang HTC eh meron silang Motorola dati pinakawalan pa nila. Um I forgot the circumstances between the Motorola deal. Um It was pressure from the manufacturers eh kasi manufacturers were like, "Hey, what are you doing with Motorola? Give us some updates." <laughs> I don't know. There was yeah. Tanong na tanong nga rin bakit nila pinakawalan yung Motorola sa so, totoo lang. Eh. James Reno, naka HCC A9 din ako kuya and still receiving software updates. That's that's awesome, pare. Um, it was confirmed na magkakaroon ako ng Android Oreo update, by the way, sa HCC 10 ko. So I'm really happy about that. Um, I wasn't expecting Android Oreo on my HCC 10, but thank God meron. Ang importante lang naman sa akin nugat eh. So I, I got, I, ang importante sa akin is the split screen multitasking. Otherwise, I'm pretty fine with um, whatever Android version I have. <clears throat> RJ Villamar, woo, baka bumalik ang Nexus phone with HCC brand sana. <laughs> it might happen. It might happen. Let's see what's gonna happen this, ano, this uh, October when the Pixel 2 launches. Ano. And also, just in case you haven't realized because of the title of the show and whatnot, iPhone launch next week, iPhone 8. So, it's crazy. The next two products I'm not too excited about. Uh, <laughs> Ito sa Vivo for for in particular wala ko invite so I don't know exactly what the heck this phone is about. Um, it's a uh, what? Okay, 6750. What? Huh? Okay, so it's got a 16 megapixel selfie. Bakit ganun? But mas mahal pa siya sa Oppo ngayon. Nag, ano, nag, ba, ba, nagbaliktad yung mundo? Ang naging habol lang sa Google na Motorola Air patents tapos nung pagbili sa Lenovo Mobile Division. Yeah, I think ganun nga yun talaga. But mas mahal pa sa ano to? Sa Oppo? Weird. Weirdness. Ngayon, I'm trying to decide if we should unbox the Oppo oh, A71. Um, kasi magsiset up ako ng ilaw and tripod and stuff like that. But we, maybe we should do that. Wizdek, what's up guys? Oh, what's up Wizdek? Um, so Vivo, by, Vivo Y69, Vigo 67, Vigo 6750, 3 gigs of RAM, 32 gigs of storage, 5.5 inch HD display, so not full HD, 13 megapixel main camera, 16 megapixel front, with LED flash and live photo. Dual SIM LTE, fingerprint scanner, Fun Touch OS, 3,000 milliamp power, 11,000 pesos. I don't like that. I don't like that price. <sighs> Especially since. Ngayon lang nakapala, been bitch watching your past streams. Hey, welcome to the show, though. Thank you for watching today. Especially since kaka usap lang natin with. Android One, it, cherry, pff, no, Xiaomi, Xiaomi M1 A1, Xiaomi Mi A1, fuck! <laughs> Ang ng mga numbers and shit. Just coming from the Xiaomi product, and then we have this Y69 with a very suggestive number, 69, Y69? Parang bastos eh. Bastos pa yung price. Nah, ni naman. It's not bad. 11k, pero ah. Uh, meron ng maraming Xiaomi ngayon, guys. Okay, so this is gonna turn the the smartphone industry upside down because Xiaomi has a lot of Snapdragon 625 under 10,000 pesos. Mi, ano ba? To, ano ba to? What's this thing? Uh, Snapdragon 435. Tingnan mo nga naman, 6,500, Snapdragon 435. Um, hindi ko alam kung alin dito yung... Hindi ako marunong magbilang. What, what's, which one has the... Uh, Redmi Note 4X? Ito, 625. Look at this, 7,200 pesos! Oh, sabi dito gray. But, uh, tingnan mo naman, gawa ng el Helotronics ito eh. Oh, okay. So, we just talked about earlier that Helotronics is gonna honor a lot of the warranty 
in for warranty problems. Diba? Neil Jewel Rama says, Xiaomi user here. I'm also have a Xiaomi right here. <laughs> there you go. Xiaomi. Think about it. Iba na to. Iba nang usapan to. Wala nang, gani wala nang ganituhan. Hindi na pwede yan. Vivo, hindi na pwede yan. Diba? O nga, yung Xiaomi Mi 5. Let's, let's look for the Mi 5, ano? Hindi na pwede yan ngayon. Hindi na papasa ngayon yan. Ito ba yung electronics ba to? This is Lucky Mobile. No, 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 no. Napin natin sa electronics. Yun yung, yun yung alam kong, ano eh, alam kong may warranty. Alam kong may mag-honor ng warranty. Baka wala naman sa electronics. Hanapin, tingnan natin na rin. <clears throat> Hindi na uubra dito ngayon yan, guys. <clears throat> wala silang Mi 5. Baka wala sila. Let's arrange, ano, sort by price. High to low. <laughs> oh, meron silang Mi Notebook Air? What the heck? That's crazy. Oh, nito silang Mi 5. Mi 5, Mi 5. S plus pa, oh. Dang! Mi Max 2. Mi 5C. Ah, Mi 5C lang. Tsaka Mi 5S plus. Ito, oh. Oh, 15 mil lang. Hindi na pwede yan, bro. Oh. Tingnan mo yung kalaban mo ngayon. Di ba? Magulo talaga si B-Boy. B-Boy kasi 69-69 pa eh. Bastos talaga ni B-Boy. Hindi na pwede. Oh, 5.7. Grabe to si, ano, si Mi 5S Plus. Oh, hindi. Galit na galit to. Oh. 64 gigs, 4 gigs RAM. 5.7 inch. Snapdragon 821. Oh, galit na galit si Kuya eh. Hindi na pwede, bros. Balik na lang tayo sa, ano, sa 4X para hindi naman masyado. Ito yung katapat niya sa specs, eh. Tawagin na nga si, tawagin na si B-Boy. <laughs> hindi na pwede yan. Ito, o, oh, magkano yung difference? O, oh, 11,000, right? 11,000 si B-Boy. B-Boy 69. <laughs> <laughs> Vivo 69 Lang yasi si Vivo 69 Bastos Hindi na pwede to Tingnan mo Okay So 11,000 versus 7,200 So ang difference mo is Around 3,800 pesos Right? Tama ba? Yes 3,000 3,800 pesos difference, right? Meron kang 3 gigs of RAM, tama. O, ilan pa yung, ano pa yung, ano pa bang meron dito? Tingnan natin specs. Okay. 32 gig storage. Mas malaki yung baterya ng Xiaomi. Mas fu full HD yung Xiaomi. Si Vivo hindi. Si Vivo hindi. O, okay. Snapdragon 625 versus MediaTek 6750. Ano nangyayari sa mundo? Baterya ng Xiaomi, 4,100 mAh. Ito yun eh. Oh, Mi 4X ito eh. Note 4X pala. Ano nga ba ito? <laughs> ito yun eh. Oh. Oh. 7,200. Hmm. Anong ila? Diyos ko naman. Oh, ito pa. Oh. Sabihin yung ano lang eh, baka mag sabihin yung isang unit lang yun. Ito, ito pa. Oh. Ito ngayon, oh. Ito, Infinix Note 4 Pro na may stylus. Oh. Oh ha? Meron pang flip case na matindi. Oh. Magkano to? 12k to. Ha? Hindi na pwede yan, Vivoy. Tang in. Si B-Boy talaga. Kinain ng sistema. Hindi na pwede yan. 11 mil? Huwag na. <coughs> B-Boy 
Magulo talaga si Bivoy. <laughs> Very paltry specs for the price. Sana nag-Snapdragon na lang si Vivo. Papun- napunta pa sa pagka-OPPO F3 version ni Ipo. Eh, si, si OPPO. Yeah. Nawagin na si Vivoy. <laughs> ah, kasalanan ni Kurian. <laughs> Oo nga. Ang mahal ng ano, mahal ng bayad kay, ano, kay, t- kay, ano, kay Curry. Vivoy kinain na ng unboxing yung Vivoy. <laughs> so... This is very ano. I know you have a 16 megapixel front camera. Meron din ganyan si Oppo eh. Ano nangyayari? Ba't ang mahal ng Vivo? Ibang klase na to. Ay, ibang klase. Ayoko na. Tama na ako dyan. So, presyo niya is 10,990. Uh, kailan siya available? Sinabi ba? Eh, whatever. So, there's one more phone before we do a final product discussion. Kasi meron tayong i-unbox ngayon eh. The... The Oppo A71. There you go. Oppo A71. Yeah. Koya, Triflare 5 versus b 16. Patulog na ako, biglang nag-notify si YouTube. Busit, late notif na naman. <laughs> uh, Takti, nasamon na naman ako dito. <laughs> <laughs> Ay, Vivoy, what's up? Vivoy, ba't ang mahal ng, ano mo, ng telepono mo? Vivoy 69. Bastos. Ang bastos ng, ano mo, ng telepono mo. 10K? 10K? Nananahimik si Vivoy dito. <laughs> Hindi ni pwede yung Vivoy 69 mo. <laughs> Unboxing Unbox Lagi ba unboxing ka na lang ng torque Kuya Hindi pwede tong Vivoy 69 Hoy Kago <laughs> Ba't ang mahal Okay anyway Kuya Vivoy What's up Huwag ka magbenta ng telepono mo Diyos ko Overpriced Nak ng tokwa <clears throat> So, ang Galaxy J7 Core announced uh, this week then. Um, this one is 10,000 pesos. Ano yung, wait, ano mong pre- processor nito? Ito baka mamaya, mapahaya na naman tayo dito ha. Ang presyo, ang ano nito ha. Pero ito kasi ano eh, Samsung to eh. So, medyo may respeto ako dyan eh. Ah, ang nga pala, Exynos nga pala to. So, we have a J7 Core kaka-announce lang. HD display, uh, 5.5 inch um, and then price is 10,000 pesos 2 gigs ay 2 gigs lang yun Wa, wag naman masakit yan nasan yung specs ko nung Samsung ko wala siguro dito eh baka na ano ko na baka nasa isang table ko eto Punta ka kasi sa spam site ni Vivo ay andun lahat ng specs. Wow! Ayoko pumunta dyan. Tangina. Ayoko dyan sa spam site mo. Ayun. Uh, ito yung specs ng J7. Ano to? Anong kailangan natin? 2 gigs of RAM talaga siya. Ay, 2 gigs lang. 16 gigs of storage. Samsung kasi. By, by the way, removable yung battery nitong J7 core. So, yun yung kakaiba dun. Um... Tingnan mo, tingnan mo si, si Meizu, binigyan tayo ng ano eh, binigyan tayo ng libro eh. Kaya sponsored by Meizu tong ano na to eh. Binigyan tayo libro. Gusto niya parafol yung libro? Ah, <laughs> uh, so, come, ito ito siya. Ayan o, binigyan tayo libro. O, oh, social eh. Ha? Huh? Wow! Wow! O oh, ha? Meron ka ba nito, B-Boy? Hindi eh, pumunta ka ng torque eh. <laughs> ano, yan, ano yan? Kinuha mo kay ate na naman na bibigay ng mga kondo. <laughs> bibigay ng mga kondo? May nagbibigay ng kondo? Ikaw, sa, sa ka nagpupupunta? Ha, B-Boy? Ha? Na may ate na nagbibigay? 
Ba't wala ka niya? Hindi ka... Tumak- tinakbuhan mo kasi yung Meizu. Ha? Nasaan yung... In- Nasaan yung ano mo? Ay, may interview ka nga pala, no? Yuck! Interview? Yuck! Puro ka sa 69. <laughs> Tama na yung B-Boy 69. <clears throat> dami, ng, dami ng telepono ng Samsung nakakalito na Pasko na naman Magpaparamdam na lang yung mga good budget phones uh, Sir, meron din yung Lieco Lay 2 sa Lazada Sino nagdala ng Lieco? Hindi naman eh <laughs> Or, <laughs> Eco bag ito eh <laughs> Ano pangalan? Paano yung spelling yung Lieco? Ano pa na spelling yung brand na yun? Leto na lang, Leto. Wala, hindi ko mahanap. Leeko. Ba't hindi ko mahanap, kuya? Smart. Wala eh. Hindi ko makita. Mga case ito eh. <coughs> B-boy, B-boy ka na ba o Infinix? <laughs> Alright, so, uh, yun yung Galaxy J7 Core. I think it's a decent Samsung product na medyo bitin lang yung RAM sa tingin ko, 2 gigs. Um, 13 megapixel, 5 megapixel front. Ang binabayaran mo dyan yung pagka-Samsung niya eh. Not bad, not bad. I would love, uh, medyo late ako sa event na to eh. Actually, super late ako sa event na to. Uh, so... Hindi ko sure kung ano yung pakiramdam ko sa telepono na yun. But I, I think for for 10K, it's not, a, the, it's not the worst thing ever for, for a Samsung product. So, yun lang ano na. Let's actually, hindi, wala kasing ano eh. Wala kasing, walang website si Samsung dyan ng J7, J7 Core. Eh. <coughs> puro yung J7 Core. Na, pag tinipe mo J7 Core, wala. Puro website ng iba. Oh, si Gadget Mat, si Yuga Tech, oh. Si Unbox. Walang, walang Samsung website na J7 Core kahit pumunta ka ng Samsung.com. Ayoko naman mang, mamirata ng, ng content ng iba, di ba? Oh, J7 Core. Wala eh. Hindi nila ina-acknowledge na ex- that exists yung J7 Core. Eh. So wala, hindi natin madidiscuss. <coughs> Overused na 7870. Medyo, medyo maano mo na. Laki-laki naman, di mo maalam spelling. <laughs> B-Boy, gusto mo ba daw bang mag-Skype? Tanongin nyo si B-Boy, kasi B-Boy, tamad yan eh. Tamad! <laughs> Tanongin si B-Boy kung sino mag-ano, sumali sa, ano, sa stream, sa Skype. Eh. Punta ka nga sa B-Boy site. Ayoko, alo. Waste it. Ayoko pumunta dun. May coverage ka ba ng Samsung? Hindi ko, wala ka naman dun eh. Yuck! Yuck! Um, ano pa gagawin natin? Ah, yung mag-unbox ba tayo? Tapos na tayo sa Samsung eh. Mag-unbox ba tayo? Kailangan ko mag-setup ng tripod. Eh. Hey. Oh, come on. Naglinis kasi ako ng kwarto dito. Naglipat-lipat ako. Kaya... Magulo ngayon. Nasaan yung tripod man ko? Where is it? Ayun. No, that's not it. Ito. No, this is the other tripod man. What the heck? Nasaan nga ba yung... <laughs> Sorry, hindi ako prepared eh. Hello! Nasaan ba yung... May waga akong camera? Sa ako nilagay? Hey. Kung hindi, hindi tayo mag-unbox. Kaya <laughs> Skype yak ano to, 2010? Oo ba? 2010 to. 
Anak, kamusta ka na dyan? Nasaan yung ano ko? Actually, naglinis ka ba yan? Parang Pilipin. <laughs> Nang ina... Gago tong... Utang ina ko, Fiboy, ha? Wala... <laughs> Bab... Pag nakita kita, ha? Hampasin kita ng sarili mong try. <laughs> Nang ina mo. <laughs> Ang gago. Nang ina mo, ngayon mo lang... Nakita ka lang... Nakakita ka lang ng kwarto to. Ano ka na? Gago ka na. Para ka ng ano. May wrestlingin nga kita. Yung ano, gagayahin ko si ano, gagayahin ko si Kong. Hala, hindi ko na matandaan kung saan yung ano, tripod mount ko. Tripod ano, yung quick release ko. Ah, ito! Tangin na. Fuck! Hirap hanapin nun ah. Natin, hana... Uh, uh. Hopefully, hindi mahatak yung kable. Mahirap na, ang mahirap ang buhay ngayon, kakalipat. Bagong, bagong lipat tayo mga ma'am, mga sir. Okay. Ma-andor pa si webcam, ha? Shit! Ano ba to? Come on! Yes! Yes! We did it, bros! Okay. Gago si Bibo, yo. Bakit gina ginagago ba kita sa sarili mong live stream ha? Ano? Para talk boy. Dalawin niyo. No. <laughs> Takin na. <laughs> Tripod after 7 years. <laughs> Tripod sa bukid yan, sir. <clears throat> na. Team na, mag-unbox na tayo. High-tech na tayo, high-tech. Nagayahin ko na si B-Boy. Live unboxing, mga kuya, mga ma'am, mga sir. Yun. Oh. Nagbukas pa ako ng ilaw, ilaw para sa inyo. <coughs> okay. We need a we need a chat box though. Let's see natin yung chat box natin. Para sa cam. <coughs> There we go. O pwede ko nang makita yung aking live unboxing area dito sa kaliwa ko eh no. Ano siya oh. Bakit kanoon? Bakit nagbago yung <laughs> baliw? Nababaliw na yung ano ko. Ano magbawas tayo ng gamit. Sorry mad. Ayun, mag sabi ko sa inyo magulo yung gamit ko eh. Ah. <coughs> Wait lang. Kailangan natin ng comments eh. CLR browser. Okay. Tapos. Nasaan yung comments ko dito? Ito. <coughs> Okay, here we go. Pwede na ba yan? Pabasa nyo na ba yan? <coughs> Gago si B-Boy, tong ina. Tong ina. Yabang. Yabang ni B-Boy, yak ako. Porkit marunong mag-live unboxing. Porkit hari ng, hari ng live unboxing. B-Boy 69. Kuya <coughs> Alex, nakapaglaro na kayo ng Player Unknown Battlegrounds. Yes! Andalas kong mag-stream ng Player Unknown Battlegrounds, kuya. <coughs> Alright! Doon na tayo. Mamamaya na to. <coughs> Oo, oh, hindi ka pa bumibili ng Player Unknown, kuya. Ito yung unbox natin muna. Para may iba tayo. Yes! Galing kay, uh, kay Kuya Leland. O, oh, ha? Kailangan kaya na... Paano ba mag-unbox si, ano, si, si Gloco? Pero si... si... O, oh, meron tayong subscribe. Wiz Tech! 
is subscriberino. Dab PUBG na tayo, B-Boy, mamaya. Oh, bili ka na. Gamitin mo yung ano, gamitin mo yung Bitcoin mo. <laughs> Dalawa yung Dalawa yung ating ano eh, uh, subscriber alert ngayon eh. Kaya may John Cena tayo at kami yung Streamlabs. So mag-unbox tayo. Ito mabilis lang kasi hindi niyo kailangan makita to eh. Pero gusto kong i-unbox sa uh, on live live show para maingit natin si B-Boy, 'di ba? Gago kasi si B-Boy eh. This is an Asus uh, AC 2900 RTX 86U dual band Gigabit Gigabit Router Okay So Para sa mga pogi lang po Meron Pogi lang po Nagkakaroon ng ganitong Router Ano Mga power Mga ano Mga paa ha Ano ha? Mga paa I-unbox ko rin naman <laughs> Gusto ko Ano eh Hindi naman natin gagawa ng unboxing video to Diba So Mas maganda na dito na sa live Sa live BTS Para ano Para wala lang Para, ma para masayang ko lang oras yung mga mga power, mga pa, di ba? Kailangan ng wrestlingin natin, gagawin natin, gagayahin natin si Kong eh. Ah! Ha! Ah! Uh! One! Two! Uh! Uh! No! Uh! Uh! One! Two! Uh! Gagawin natin si Power! Mm! Uh! Uh! Gagawin natin. Gagawin mo ka si Lilan sa akin Wala tayong wrestling sounds eh Hindi natin pwedeng gayahin si ano si Kong Wala tayong sounds ng wrestling Napagod ako dun ah, hiningal ako ah, walang nga Oh, ang bango Mmm Bango sa loob Mmm Ah, may paa Wow Experience the difference between a winning and losing move Ah, Grimer's friend Wow Oh, ayan yung tatlong antena nyo Oh, kaya ayan po mga kaibigan Ay, bakit nagugulong ako yung Mason na bag Yun Tatlong antena, pagkalaki-laki ang antena mga sir Wow, ang bigat ito ha Oh, matindi, big time Wow! As oh my God! Ang laking crowder! What the hell? Wow! May... Galit si kuya, oh! Galit yung router na to! Ang laki! Damn, bro! That's huge! Siyempre, oh! ROG, oh! <laughs> ROG! ROG, the best! ROG number one yung, ano, yung router natin, oh! Stig! Ano pa meron dito? VIP member warranty notice Wow Ang bango Wow Dual band gigabit router Okay And then Meron tayong ethernet cable Power supply Power Power supply Okay Power Ano to? Adapter ng ibang bansa Carbon coupling ng router na yan Yung sunet gear Ganun ba? Hindi ko alam eh Isang adapter na naman sa ibang bansa Lahat ito adapter sa ibang bansa So tapos na That's it for our unboxing of the Ano Asus router Tante, ang laki nyo oh Bigatin Ang, ang bigat actually, sa totoo lang Matindi Pang ano to, pang mga power ito bro, Mga kuya Tsaka walang fingerprint Ang galing Akala ko mapipingerprint pero wala oh Yes Okay to Astig Kakabitan ko ito. Gagamitin ko ito para makapag... Uh, ano tayo? Makapower, makapag-power tayo mga paa. <coughs> Makapag-download tayo sa ano. Kung saan-saan. May fiber naman tayo. Kaya yan. Okay. Balik na natin sa kahon. Unbox na natin si Oppo. Matapos na itong show na ito. <coughs> B-Boy, iniwan na tayo. Sigurado lang. Eh. Gano na yan eh. Nanonood ng porn yan. Ng B-Boy 69. <laughs> <coughs> Parang maliit na laptop eh, no? Parang may laptop dito. Buksan mo na lang laptop na eh. Yun, no? Kaya lang, mukhang ano eh. Mukhang router eh. Okay, yun na yun. That's it. Yes. Meron tayong router. 
i-reviewin natin yan Napagod ako, pinawisan ako dun ah Damn! Mahirap maging kong mga kuya Ito na tayo Oppo A71 Ito yung bago ni Oppo And uh, This is priced at uh, 8,000 If I'm not mistaken Meron ako na dito eh Let's watch our ano Let's watch our hands-on video muna Magkano ba to? Name it, I forget <coughs> Dito 4K render ko dito eh 4K Oppo A71 Utilizes a unibody um, design philosophy. Our first prototype time here in the building. Secondly, um, if you compare the A71 with yeah. the design, the more rounded. Seven upper upper. What is it? A five-inch display, I think. HD. Uh, we have a octa-core processor here, a MediaTek 6750. <laughs> Pretty standard for this kind of uh, phone. It's not bad. It's not bad. My my selfie camera is is destroying the colors right now, but it's it's actually looking better in person. Um, this is now Android 7.1, though I can't find the the multi window. The price dito, I can't seem to find it. Um, maybe it's hidden somewhere. Maybe you have to turn on the X60. This is a five inch. Hours we have a 13. The UI is relative. It is. What else? Oh, I like the design. It's a. Uh... Google ko na lang. Tira tamad ako eh. Ay, si B-Boy, may video nito. Ay, alam, bulok yung video niya eh. Corny. Corny hands-on. Napin natin. <coughs> you know, 8,990. Yun yung price. 16 gigabytes of internal storage with 5.2 inch IPS display with scratch resistant glass. Also, it comes with a... Okay, it's na 8,990. So, let's do the unboxing, mga kuya. Let's do it. Alright. So, ito yung box. Oppo. Zoom. Ko close up tayo, close up. Oh, huh? Damn. Look at that. Okay. Oppo A71. Ito yung kanilang uh, upper entry level, 8,990 peso phone. Na bagong design philosophy na. Bagong design philosophy. But may sticker. Okay. Uh, actually ginamit ito nung ano eh ginamit ito nung event kaya may ano may konting dumi may konting uh, yak may konting fing, ano grease <coughs> o bakit nandiyan si Ison nandiyan si Kuya Ison wala ba't kayo nag-iison ah hindi yung yung nasa video si Ison wait lang nasa, my, my TV is saying mamamatay na siya nasa na yung aking remote ng TV but Ito. Jeez. <laughs> Boink. Okay. Yes, yeah, si Kuya Ison yun. Uh, sorry, nagkakagulo ako dito. Hindi ko matandaan ko nasa yung comments ko. Walang chat yung YouTube sa mobile browser ko. What? Really? Kuya, nakabuy me, buy na me PUBG. Laro tayo PUBG mamaya, b-boy. So, may livestream natin yan eh. Alright. So, Oppo... Oppo A71. Kaya lang gusto kong linisin ng konti. Med medyo nalagyan na sila nalagyan ng ano, nalagyan ng uh, grasa. Siguro si Biboy humawak nito. Alam mo naman, alam mo naman ka kamay ni Biboy na 69 na yung kamay ni Biboy ng sobra-sobra kaya sobrang gra taong grasa si Biboy. <clears throat> Yan. So, ay nakabukas pa pala to. Damn, look at that. Oh, pretty smooth, guys. There we go. Ayos Pwede na pala ako mag-unbox dito Malinaw na Kahit pa paano kaya na Tsaka nakakapag-focus na siya Yes Oh look at that Alright Yes So this is the Oppo A71 8,990 pesos And uh, Meron siyang kasaling case Ito So <laughs> Magkakalat tayo ng Oppo <laughs> Sorry uh, We have a Oppo What is this? Quick guide You know I have to admit, yung packaging ni Oppo uh, is very top-notch, you know? uh, one of the nicer packaging. Hindi naman sobrang mamahalin packaging, but it's just a little bit luxurious ng konte, where you think the product is, yung, 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 they put a little bit more time and effort into their packaging. We have a white uh, power brick right here, na medyo kakaiba in design, may konting gray area dun sa top. Uh, this is a... 5 volts, 1 milliamp 
charger. Look at that. I like na parang, eh, mo ko, may pagka old school 90s uh, computer yung ano yung charger niya. Paano balik yung charger? Pag ganun siguro. Yeah, baka nga. <coughs> Hindi, ganun. Nagets ko na. Okay, so we have an Oppo headset right here. Pretty nice. Pretty, I like the fact, gusto gusto ko na meron ako sa screen na to ng, uh, ng mahiwagang live, ano ko. Buti dito na ako nagsistream with the, with the main camera. At least na monitor ko yung aking stream. Yan nata yung demo unit natin. Baka nga. So yan, meron tayong uh, headset. Ano? And then, meron tayong charger of course. Tignan mo, tignan mo naman yung pagka-bundle ng kanilang kable, di ba? That's, that's attention to detail at a little, at little bit. Ano? Oh, look at that, bokeh. Oh. B-boy, marunong na ako mag-bokeh. Pwede na akong, ano? Pwede na ako. Oh, tignan mo, bokeh. Oh. Yan lang, sobrang bokeh naman. Yan, bokeh. Oh. Okay, let's look at the phone. So this is a Sna uh, MediaTek 6750. Ito, siyang important information. Guapo talaga ng mga manuals and paperwork ni Oppo. Kahit pa paano. Maganda yung consistency of branding and whatnot. Ba? <coughs> and ang gusto ko ngayon is yung bagong design language ni Oppo, which is the, with the Oppo A71. Kamukha na siya ng... Um, what do you call this? Kamukha na siya ng Oppo R11 Which is basically the same design as the, the OnePlus 5 OnePlus 5 sobrang guwapo nun Paano ba natin mabalik to lahat? <laughs> yes Yes Boom Ay, ito nakalimutan ko Mamaya na yan Okay Yon Okay, balik natin sa kahon Yon Okay Yan siya Oppo A71 uh, Plastic uh, ang, ang ano po nito Hindi po siya bakal ano? Plastic po ito eh um, But Magaan siya And maganda siya tignan Yung kahit pag, pag malayo Siguro Iisipin mo bakal to eh um, And then Medyo dahil sa ilaw Medyo Nakikita mo yung Yung pandikit dito Pero pwede naman mawala yan eh. We have a Oppo logo right here Camera uh, Which is I believe 13 megapixel dito Bokay ng Nino <laughs> Gago talaga itong b-boy na to Yan, so may uh, I think dual LED flash siya na may diffuser ano? Tapos Ang maganda siya, curved uh, ano, curve na yung side siya Tignan mo yung, tignan mo yung pagka-curve dito no? Kwapo yan eh, ang ganda pakiramdam It's so soft on the hand again ano? Although I don't know kung medyo I don't, I don't assume it's I, I mean, I, I think it's slightly less grippy than it should Pero ganun talaga yung design niya eh Parang Oppo R11 kasi uh, mas, man, mas makapal siya ng konti sa Oppo R11 if I'm not mistaken Pero, same same look and feel Dito lang sa harap, medyo mapapansin mo Hindi ganun katingkayad yung screen uh, Even though maganda naman siya tignan sa totoo lang Hindi pa rin ganun ka, ano, kasi uh, on closer inspection This is a 720p display, no? But, I think kung ititweak nila ng konti yung yung display nito baka pwede nilang iano eh pwede nilang itaas yung saturation or something kaganda ng konti ang uh, i think ang kalaban mo dito is i think when it comes to the display it might not be like 100 uh, where it might not be close to 100% sRGB or uh, Adobe RGB like yun yung those kinds of denominations ang ang nag nagdedetermine kung ano yung quality ng display so for example i'll give you a a, a comparison here Pwede natin pakita yung display ng, for example, the uh, Surface Pro 4, which is 100% uh, sRGB display ito eh. So, yun lock natin with my face. There we go. Look at how, it's not about the resolution so much. Uh, let's find like something to show. Ano mong pictures ko dito? Baka may, baka may uh, hindi ako pwede. Ito na lang. <laughs> si Chester. <laughs> Yeah, hindi yung gandang picture. Basta, let's, let's, <laughs> let's use the uh, uh, personalize and then let's use a wallpaper like that. Okay. So, makikita nyo yung difference in, in quality of uh, image uh, between the... It's not about the resolution so much. It's the quality of the, the colors of the display some, a little bit. The blacks 
and the saturation and whatnot, diba? But uh, keep in mind, this is a 9,000 peso phone from Oppo. And ang binabayaran mo dito is not the display so much. It's, it's the it's the it's the design of and the Oppo branding. So we have the 720p display. Look at that. Yung bezels are slightly on the you know not so thin side. Tika mo, meron tayong bezel dito sa so left side, meron tayong bezel sa so le so, so right, left side, right side. Sorry. And then meron tayong bezel sa so top and bottom. And uh, it feels a little on the plastic side, but it looks not on the plastic side, right? It looks bakal, but it's plastic. Or quote-unquote polycarbonate. And then we have a relatively smooth UI here, uh, which is, I believe, ang tag dito sa UI ni Oppo, I forget eh. Um, this is a... Color OS, yon. Color OS, and uh, smooth naman siya. Hindi naman ako nagreklamo, right? So it, it's running pretty good. I, I think if I antuto natin to, it's I met. Kima kanas palato yun. <laughs> it's a makanas phone. Um, let's try their ano, their selfie. Now with the lighting conditions here, it's actually pretty good. Little bit of delay sa ano sa pagkuha ng picture, but it's not terrible and then main camera let's take a picture of Fujiko there go there we go yeah medyo madilim no oh nag flash no 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 turn off the flash funny turn off the flash there we go off okay Everything picture niya. 13 megapixel. But in hot. It's not bad, although it's a little bit dark in my opinion. Uh, obviously, na, medyo, medyo blurred na pagdating sa inyo, pero ito na flash eh. uh, And then a selfie. Yeah, it's not, it's not the best. It's not the best, but I can forgive it a little bit. I think this is a 5 megapixel selfie, if I'm not mistaken. <sighs> sa pagpapakita ng pics ko ano ang mas stream mo you, eh? what do you mean kung ano ang mas stream ko <clears throat> so pabalik ko muna yung surface pro ko bago masira ako it's not a bad looking phone and it's an oppo phone for 9000 pesos with a free case kabit natin yung case Yung lang yung mga case ng Oppo, sobrang hirap ikabit. Medyo lumalaban siya eh. Hindi siya design na talagang kumabi, ano eh, uh, slip on eh. It's not a slip on case so much. It's more like a uh, labanan on. There we go. Alright, so may case na tayo. Let's go. And there it opens. but sabi niya? Alas 12 na. Hindi pa. 12.57 pa lang. So meron tayong clear case on the back. And then medyo parang frosted yung sides niya Frosted, frosted, frosted. Um, ewan ko, may, may konting gaspang yung, corn, yung sides nitong ano, nung, uh, nung case. Although I think it's not bad. The, the, the buttons, keep in mind, look at the buttons, right? The navigation buttons. I don't think they light up. Diba? So that's another distinction dito. But overall, I think it's a decent Oppo phone for 9,000 pesos. It's... It's a little bit on the higher side of the spectrum when it comes to price for the specs that we're looking at here. Um, honestly, though, I think it's not a bad op it's not a bad phone for an Oppo product. You could definitely get a better phone like a Xiaomi, and I know if you want to compare it. Here's a here's a Xiaomi Note 4X, right, with a full HD display, metal body. This is plastic, right? And has a 4,000 milliamp hour battery. This has, uh, what's the battery on the Oppo A71? Uh, Oppo A71. So 3,000 milliamp hour battery. Okay. Yeah, sabi ni Kuya Norm, sakto lang. 
But you know, we're, there's a very there's very tight competition right now, especially with products from Hellotronics, uh, particularly the Xiaomi products that they're bearing. This is just ridiculously nice priced for seven thousand two hundred. Um, but like I said, you're buying the Oppo brand. You're buying, you know, a little bit of the selfie expert in there, a little bit of the the nice packaging and stuff like that. Even though the Xiaomi has decent packaging as well. Um, yeah. So I mean, I don't want to buy because I'm buying the Xiaomi. But I wish the display was better. That's the that's the only thing I could wish for so much. I mean, the bezels could be better and the display could be better. But number one thing is. I think the, the display could be much better. And wala siyang wala siya uh, super thing kaya that I'm looking for. Uh, let me where's my uh, HTC here. Let's find a photo that we can use. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, tingnan mo, yung yung parang the the colors are not Super saturated and there's no dark or, or what, but eh, sakto lang like Norm said. Not gonna complain. Ooh, there we go. Drop test. Drop test ng aking HTC. Kaya magalala ba kalyan with a case? May malaki laki pa siyang case. Yo, there's a close up of my HTC 10. I know not a lot of people have seen the HTC 10 in up close, so there's a close up of it. Beautiful phone. Even though it's a relatively small display, 5.2 inch. 20k I bought this phone. Using it for vlogging every day. Very good. Very good phone. Okay. So, that's the Oppo A71. I don't think we're getting questions so much nung, uh, pr about the product. So, uh, we're just gonna go to the end of the show by moving the camera back to the... Uh, the original position. All right. Okay. By the way, this is the first time. If you're not, I know. If you just started watching, this is the first time we're using this uh, setup for proper live streaming. So let me know if that uh, kind of s the setup was effective or not. We've we've uh, we've only been live streaming before Dun Salikod. Um, now that we're now we're live streaming now on a a. Kung saan nakaupo ako sa actual chair so you can see my chair here. Woo! <laughs> oh, wireless wireless headset so I can do that. Um, still using the 1,000 peso wireless headset that is very very good. You're hearing the audio from the wireless headset as well. So, that's proof of concept for that wireless headset right there. Alright, so what do we need to... D oh, I can put my... Put my another keyboard. Anyway. Ligpit ng konte before we end the show. It's 12 o'clock. I think that's proper time to end the show. What else do we need to discuss? Anybody? Anybody have a question? Olana, so sabi PUBG is real. B-boy, naroon na tayo PUBG. Let's, let's see if B-boy has PUBG already. B-boy, gano'n katagal bago mag-install ka ng PUBG? Uh, 800 plus binayaran. Oh, haha. Okay lang. Bitcoin money naman. Galing eh. <laughs> B-boy in the Bitcoins. So, buhay ng ninong mo. Atin. Hindi ko man alam kung friend ko si B-boy Hindi naman ata totoong tao si Biboy. Hindi naman nagsistrip pirata ata si Biboy. Alright guys, so that's it for the show. That's um, that's a BTS before. PUBG na, tama na. <laughs> I'm using my, you know. Um, Oye, oh magkano yung router mo? Actually, hindi ko alam. That's a good question, ano? Bago natin matapos yung show. Ano to? Asus RTAC86U Asus RC86U Tama ba? AC86U pala Asus RT Dash 
AC 86U po siya. Ang haba naman ng pangalan na yun. My God! 7,000 sa Play Asia. Sa Gearbest is $180. <coughs> Magkano kaya sa Pilipinas? Philippines. Mahal din, ano? Uh, because routers, ganun talaga eh. Pang, ano talaga eh. Pang, pang matigasan talaga router. <coughs> if it's a good router, you, you only have to buy one. Hindi naman ito yun eh. Magkaiba tayo. Iba na yung router ngayon. Magkamukha sila, pero hindi ROG design yung... ROG design yung kanina eh. Diba? Yung in-unbox natin. Bago siguro to. Pareho sila eh. RT AC86U Pero lumang design nito oh. Hindi pa ROG ROG na yung sa atin Mga kuya Ayun, ayun oh You know $180 So mga less Dapat uh, Mga ano Ano ba to? 8,000 pesos Mga ganun Not bad, not bad Even though there's There's super cheap routers out there I'm still fine with uh, if if kaya niya talaga eh, you know, sa US ganun na eh ROG na eh although hindi ko naman hindi naman ata branded as ROG ito but still it looks ROG kasi ayos yan ayos yan looks nice pogi naman siya hindi naman siya sobrang over the top design ni. Eh. Uh, Give me 15 minutes to download yun. Gusto mo mag ano tayo? Saan tayo mag-stream b-boy? Mag ano tayo? PUBG tayo? Turuan kita. <laughs> Mamatay tayo lagi. <laughs> Kuya Bui Boy ang model ng twerk. Give me 15. V-Boy 69. Yun ang magandang name. Sa, sa Steam V-Boy 69. Nasa Discord ako. Alam mo yung Discord ni ano? Ni, ni Gian sa Gadget Pilipinas. Ayun ro, si b-boy oh. <laughs> PUBG looking for groups Sino yun? Sino yun? But Wala naman eh Hindi naman naglalaro eh Anong oras yun? At tomorrow at 12 Bakit tomorrow at 12 3, 3, 3, 4... What the fuck? Na... Why is What? Baliw si ano Si Discord Ba't sinasabi tomorrow Yung ano Yung comments What? Yesterday yan Gago Ano ba? Gago <coughs> game noobs ako <laughs> Immersive gaming Dito ako mag live sa stream Anong dito ako mag live What do you mean Saan ka mag live Hindi ko gets Hindi ibig sabihin ko kasi Dahil sa uh, undersea The internet uh, ano Undersea internet cable cuts May mag stream sa certain Ano ngayon Servers ngayon Kaya nag-iingat ako Kaya lang naman Okay, so yun ang ating uh, ano, um, mag-announce na lang tayo kung maglalaro kami ni Bibo. Yan ang sami ko sa kami magla-livestream. Um, hindi pa ako nakapag-decide, hindi pa tayo nakapag-decide kung sa tayo. <coughs> uh, kamusta yung chair ko? It's right here. Um, inuupo ako ngayon. Yay! <laughs> Nag-model eh, no? Yan siya. Nag-model talaga ako. Wow! 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 Model! Wow! Wow! Yan siya. <laughs> Nahihiya ako Shy ako Shy Yan siya 3,600 pesos Pwede na Mukha matibay naman Inuupuan ko eh Kinaya ako eh <clears throat> Game, game, game Sige, kung ikaw magla-live Doon tayo manood Doon kayo manood KB Boy Alright So Yun ang ating Makakatapusan ng ating Livestream mga kuya At uh, mukhang magpa-PUBG tayo Tuturuan natin si B-Boy Para hindi na siya noobs diba? Gusto akong ibili ng friends ko ng PUBG Kaso di ata kaya ng net ko Yun lang Ano lang siya uh, Mga 6 gig, 7 gigs Yun lang Kung yung, internet, kung yung connectivity ang importante Alright guys uh, That's it for the show Mag-PUBG tayo Mag-announce lang ako sa BTS community uh, Kung magla-livestream si B-Boy kung saan Hinahin ng sistema si Kuya V-Boy V-Boy 69 Hashtag 
Bboy69 <coughs> So Wala na <laughs> Hindi ko alam paano mag-ending tuloy ng stream Alright guys, so thank you for watching I'm Alex from thetechnoclass.com That's been the big time show for uh, Ano mga yun? September 9, 2017 Pasali, sir Pasali <laughs> hmm. Nag-ahaya yung isa kong barkada si, uh, Isa kong kaklase si Si Jem Chair model. <laughs> okay, guys. Ayun. So, baka maglalaro tayo ng patayin mo contador mo tapos yan. Tapos yan kagad. Anong contador? What the hell? Ano? <laughs> Loko tong gagon tong b-boy na to, ah. Papatayin ko na yung ilaw ko. Madalit mo. Ano? Yan. Basa natin. Dalawang ilaw muna. Alright, guys. Thank you for watching. That's it for the show. Alex from TechnoClass.com here. Uh, on behalf of everybody who's watching And si B-Boy And maglalaro tayo ng PUBG Gusto nyo panahon si B-Boy Maging tanga sa PUBG <laughs> John R says Asus number one uh, Kung gusto nyo makita ng noob si B-Boy sa PUBG uh, Magla-livestream siya Hindi ko alam kung saan siya magla-livestream Kung ano server or what not Kasi feeling ko hindi niya pa nararamdaman ang, ang full brunt of the ano, Asus Undersea Cable Cuts <sighs> Para makita ko gameplay yan, mananood si Nyao Nyao yun. So, alright, so, let's, uh, let's, let's, uh, shift gears and play PUBG. Nang, kung gusto nyo talaga manood, alas dos, alam ko alas dos na, pero kung gusto nyo talaga manood, we're gonna play some PUBG late in, uh, late, uh, or early this, early today. <laughs> let's do it! So, sige, bye-bye guys. See you guys next week again, and then we'll talk about, uh, the iPhone 8. Bye-bye!